Isn't it good it's Friday? <laughs> Turn that down a little bit. Hello everyone, how are you doing? It's a very good, oh, I can, oh, I've got a slider. Oh, that's exciting. Oh, I can, I can fade to my house. Anyway, hello everyone. Um, I'm dead on time as well. I'm not two minutes late. You're two minutes late. You're two minutes early. <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, I was doing some, apologies, I was doing some DIY in the house. And uh, yeah, I got, <laughs> got sidetracked. <laughs> and then was quickly like, oh, I look like a hot, sweaty mess. And now I just look like a mess. I'm not hot. I'm ne neither hot nor sweaty. So I'm just turn studio mode off. Just make sure everything's okay. Yeah, everything's fine. I've gone for a lower profile on my uh, webcam today because I just kind of fancied it. I'm also don't think I'm gonna need my keyboard for this because I'm hoping this game has mount has uh, uh, controller support. But we'll find out. We're gonna be playing um, a short hike. I've not played a short hike yet, and this is a little odd for me. That I'd play a game on Lo-Fi Gaming that I've not played before. But I kind of figure if, and this is the stuff that the, the YouTube people will never see. I kind of figure that if it is a Lo-Fi game and we love it and it is what we consider to be Lo-Fi, then it will go on the channel, right? And then if it's not, it will just disappear to the VODs channel. Just disappear to the VOD Oasis. Never to be seen again. I've also got my window open so you'll be able to hear all the beautiful sounds of Nottingham. Namely, people screaming at each other and sirens. So, for a little while anyway. Just because I'm incredibly warm. So, let's go short hike. That's not how you start a game, Mike. Let's shut that music off. Oh, that's very far away, isn't it? Why is my stream deck all that far away? There we go. Oof. Oh, I haven't got my lights on. There we are. I'm a bit... God, it's a bit bright. It's a bit bright for a Friday. Ooh. That's nice. Get rid of my mouse cursor. Thank you. I don't know if this has controller support. I'll be perfectly honest with you. A short hike. Press Z to start. I'm going to assume it does. Um, okay. So, I don't know anything about this. I'm going to try and do a YouTube intro right now so that we can uh, crack on with the game as much as possible. If, so we're only for, I'm here for about three hours. If this is only a short game, because again, I don't know how long it is, we're going to jump on something else, uh, something equally cosy. But I'm going to do a quick say say hello. One day. One day, your mic will learn how to talk. Not today, though. Um, I'm going to say a quick hello to the people on YouTube. And then we're going to crack on. So That's all right for that, that volume, isn't it? Yeah, that's quite nice. Background volume, that. Hello everyone and welcome back to Lo-Fi Gaming, probably the chillest place on the internet for gameplay. Today we're going to be taking a look at a short hike. Now I know nothing about a short hike other than the fact it's been recommended several times to me and it looks gorgeous. So if you like this video, hit the like button. If you dislike it, please use the dislike button. But don't forget to let me know in the comments either way. And if you want to help the channel out for free, you can by subscribing to Lo-Fi Gaming. If you want to join the players here on Twitch, you can join us over at twitch.tv forward slash peripheral mic. And that's pretty much it. So without further ado, let's dive in. Oh, there we go. Wallop. Edited my first video, uh, my first uh, YouTube episode. Um, for the Spookies Jump Scare Mansion game, and uh, actually use those those end pieces as uh, as uh, uh, cuttings, and it was it was really good. It it worked really really well, to be honest with you. Um, okay, options, graphics, audio, controls, languages, controls, gamepad. Oh, that's, that's oh, it's a lot of it's a lot of graphics there. Uh, yeah, graphics, pixel size, big and crunchy, medium rare, small and tasty, tiny and sharp, minimum. More games should have these um, options for graphics, I'm not going to lie. Borderless windowed, image quality, perfect. Oh, shadows, perfect. Uh, yeah, that, that all seems fine. Display FPS, out of interest. Why FPS are we getting? Well, you're not going to tell me now, are you? Disabled. New gam. I never get tired of this view, Claire. 
You're going to have a great time here this summer, I think. It'll be good to get away from the city and take a break from everything else going on. Are you still awake? Hmm? Maybe? Hold on a little longer. We're almost at the ferry. Sounds cute. I like it. A humble original by... Oh, words are too fast. Oh, look at... Oh, I'm... I'm glorious. Look at me. Right, what do the graphics options do? Options. Graphics. Big and crunchy. Minimum. Oh, I see. Oh, minimum then. I want to be... Oh, look at that. That's much better. It's a bit like Tunic. I like it. Hello. Hi. <gasps> Pretty colours. Yes. Hello, undeveloped... Hello, undeveloped Bruce. How are you doing today? Hey, how's it going? I haven't seen you all day. You been busy? Uh, kind of. Well, not really. <laughs> Same. I've just been waiting around for a call. Well, there's your problem. There's no reception out here. Wait, what? Yeah, I mean, pretty much no reception. You might be able to get someone at Hawk Peak. Oh, yeah, I guess. That's pretty far, isn't it? It's not that far. You've made... We've made... <laughs> we've all made the trek before. I figured you would have gone already. Oh, yeah. I've been meaning to go, but I just haven't gotten around to it yet. Well, today is a good a day as any. Mm. Just take White Beach Trail and head north at the fork. But what about the knife? Then follow the signs for Hawk Peak. No problem. <gasps> da -da -da. Fire. What else can I do? I can jump. I've established that. What is this? Uh, cell phone. It's useless without reception. Not even the games work offline. That's fair. Uh, so that's my Y key. So I can't do anything else other than maybe twizzle the camera, which is which is fine. So I'll look over here. Mm. <gasps> a gem. What is this? I found a shell. How far out can I go? Mm, how far out do I want to go? This seems irresponsible. Oh, wow. Fortune favors the brave. Don't forget that, kids. Oh, what's that? It's a stick. It's a stick that I can wield. Oh, I picked up a, a coin. I think I picked it up by walking over it. This, These fish look very Cozy Grove-ish. They definitely are there from Cozy Grove. What's this say? Uh, back to Hog Peak Island. Okay, so that's where I was. But I would like to explore this bit more. A shell. Oh, needed this today. Can I can I bash things? No. It's been another one of those weeks. You know those weeks where you just don't want to do anything. I had a real grumpy moment earlier where I was like, basically something went wrong with the house and I was like, oh, I hate it here. <laughs> no, this is our home, right? So I'm just like, I hate it. I hate all of this. I hate this house. I hate everything. I had a proper, proper grump earlier. But my wife, being the absolute soldier that she is, um, sort of dragged me out of it. We did some DIY and now I feel tons better. And uh, yeah. Um, I, I, at first, I was wondering whether or not... Why can I see through this rock? No. I was wondering whether or not I was going to do lo-fi gaming today. I was going to just do some more spooky um, house of jump scares. But I kind of think, given the week it's been... Given the couple of weeks it's been... Oh, wow. that's Oh, no, I've slid. Oh, dear. Given the couple of weeks it's been... I don't think I can get up there. But I think I need just a bit of a chill. Like, a bit of a chill out. And what better way to do that? Oh, I can glide. Oh, that's lovely. I can't do anything when I'm gliding, I don't think. No. Okay. Well, I tell you what. This feels like the sort of thing we'll... What was that? 
weird. Um, this is what sort of thing we'll come back to later. Where's the sign for Hopi Garland? Because I don't really want to just go blue or wandering into the sea. I mean, that's exactly what I'm about to do. So, scoosh. Let's just go this way and assume this is fine. <gasps> trash. Sea trash. Oh, it's not sea trash. It's one of those, well, it's one of those things. It's, it's an invisible wall. What better way to chill than to rapidly, repeatedly fall from great height? I mean, I always find that. When in doubt, throw yourself off something semi-tall. Not necessarily tall, tall, but semi-tall. Right? Don't cause yourself any injuries. But, you know, it's like when you were a kid. It's re revisiting that feeling when you were a kid and you used to jump off like the third or fourth step. Don't tell me. Don't tell me no one knows what I'm talking about. You all know what I'm talking about. You all know what I'm talking about. Where am I going? I, I can't help but feel this is not how this game is supposed to be played. Go. Is this Hog Peak Island again? Am I back where I need to be? Oh, I've lost my stick. Oh, oh no, I've not. Oh, that was what I was doing. I was putting the stick away. Yoink. Hello, friend. Yo. This updraft is on point. You can get some sick dives on it. Uh, how do you dive? Oh, damn. That's easy. But it takes some practice. You gotta hear me out. First, you gotta go. You gotta be gliding. As you know, you glide by holding B. Then, if you're high enough off the ground, release your control stick to dive downwards. But you must still remember to hold B. Is it B? Are you sure? That's the tricky part. With a good dive, you can build up a lot of speed. You can practice by gliding of over the subdraft. That'll give you a lot of height to work with. Alrighty. Okay, it's not B, it's A. Just so, just in case anyone's wondering. Whee! Whee! Let's dive into the ocean. Dive, oh, a chest. Let's go for that. Monies! Spoosh. Nice. Now I know how to dive. Hey yo. Yeah, I'm just chilling here. Soaking up these sweet, sweet rays. As I long, as long as I got my SPF 50, I could lie here for sweet, sweet days. Nice. That was nice. Damn, you know it. It's nice like some rice with spice. I like this guy. I like the toucan. Terry toucan you can, can stay in the game. 100%. Uh, what's over here? What's this? No, nothing. Oh, a gem. Uh, a shell. Is, is this the way I'm supposed to be going? There's music now, so I don't know if this is the way I'm supposed to be going. I'm completely lost already. I've been here 30 seconds. Hi, hi, Captain. How's it going? I can't jump over the box. There we go. Howdy. Hi. What you doing? Ah, I be taking a break. <laughs> Don't tell anyone, all right? Mm, I won't. I don't even know who I tell. <laughs> Good. We can't wait to be done today. Say, when my shift's over, I'll be out catching me some rare fish. It's me hobby, you see. If you happen to net some fish yourself, bring them to me. And I'll trade your coin. Well, I would if I had a fishing rod. You know, my friend Bill might be able to lend you one. He's out fishing all the time. Nice. If I see Bill, I'll ask him. Oh, there's a thing there. Oh, a shell. Thank you. I'm digging this music. Hello, questionable results. How are you on this fine Friday evening? What's through here? Nothing. This, I assume, will give me phone reception, though. Right? Uh, ooh. This way. Uh... Really know. 
where to go from there. I don't think there is a place to go from there. Oh. <laughs> I appear to have made my game lag for some unknown reason. Oh, oh, I slipped. I slipped and fell. Hey, I'm back at the start. <laughs> well, now I know where I'm going. White Coast Trail. Ranger's Cabin. Got it. Hello, fellow bird person. Claire! Did you know you can hold B while running and glide through the air? It's A, but okay, I get your point. Of course, everyone knows that. Why do you ask? Mm hmm. I just had a feeling you might want to know. Um, okay. And glide. Glide for the pennies. Whoa. Ah, the sound of needing away. All you hear in your head whenever you need a way. Can I bash this? No, I can't. Come here, bird person. Hey, you! Find me 15 shells! Uh, what? Why? I want them! Yeah, but why? It's a secret. Uh, isn't that B-O as in button O? Oh, maybe. Maybe. Huh. Okay. I'll keep an eye out. Keep both eyes out, please. Also, hello, Darcy Sue. How are you today? So what's the deal with these shells? It's none of your business. Except... That was wrong voice. For the business of you getting me 15 of them. Is this a protection racket? I, am I am I in trouble if I don't get you these shells? Uh, right. Oh, I've got... Oh, lovely. Oh, this is my inventory. Got it. Uh, controls. Gamepad. You are correct. Button zero. You're not wrong. When you're right, Darcy Sue, you are right. That's what I always say. It's one of my famous quotes. Uh, Ranger's cap in Waco Show. Can I go in here? Knock, knock, knock. I'm ginormous in comparison to this house. Let's, okay, let's go down here. Ooh, lovely. Donk. Wow, that's loud. No, don't go in the sea. Oh, someone's going to be very happy with me. What's this? It's money. Uh, button. Button, button. Maybe I can club a fish. No? I don't think that's how you... I don't think that's how you fish. It's a wild stab in the dark. Which is also not how you fish. From previous experience. Can I bounce on this? Oh, yes, I can. <laughs> ah, ah. Oh, I missed. Curses. Hello, friend. Hey, Claire. How's the day treating you? Well, I'm just getting out of the house now. Uh, it's one of those kind of days. Yeah. I've been kind of caught up in my head all morning. Hmm. Would you say you feel lost and directionless? Uh, maybe. Welp. I've got just the thing for you. Take this. You found a compass. You said you found. You found a compass. If you can't club one, can you at least tuna fish? Ah, oh, Darcy Sue with the fantastic tuna fish pun. To use it, press button three to open your inventory. That's the Y button for those of you keeping score. And uh, then select it from the items menu. Uh, oh, thanks. This should come in handy. Happy hiking! Show me the compass. There we go. Just shows it automatically. Fantastic. Uh, right. D uh, d bouncy, bouncy. That's what I wanted to do. <laughs> oh, I missed. <laughs> God damn it. Boing. Oh, I missed again. Oh, I completely screwed that one up. Oh, I wasn't looking at the screen. Oh. oh, that's not a good dive. That's not a good dive in the slightest. Come on, I'm overthinking this. Yeah, really, I'm overthinking this. 
What if I need the momentum? I'm gonna just dive off this one. No, I think I need the momentum. Oosh, oosh. Some time later. Okay, I says, wait, hang on. Am I being like super duper dumb? Yes. Oh, why is it taking me over here? God damn it. Where am I going? Oh, money. <laughs> the loot goblin in me will always find something. Ooh, a hole. I have nothing to dig with other than a stick, and I don't think I can dig for treasure with a stick. A uh, chest. Some coins. Currency. Lovely, lovely currency. Ugh. I also saw the chest down here. No one panic, I saw the chest. Yum. Hello, friend. Hey, dude. What's happening? That was the wrong voice again. Oh, you know. Just jamming out on the beach. Building sand castles and whatnot. Mm, sounds like a good time. You know it. Uh, can I borrow your shovel? Sorry, bud. I need it for sand castle construction. Isn't it a little big for that? Yeah, but it's just how shovels are. You can get smaller ones. Ones made for sand castles. What? Sounds fake. But if you can show me one, I'd be glad to trade. Alright, cool. We have a quest. I'm not hitting that person's sand castle. Honestly thought that was a wall of shells then. I'm going to come back and speak to you two in a second. Boing. 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 No boing. Boing. Oh no. Yes. Whee. Hello. Hey there. What are you up to today? Uh, I'm hiking up to Hawk Beak. Oh, that's a tough hike. You know, you'll need to learn to rock climb to make it to the top. Why not join our rock climbing club? Uh, oh. Is it just the two of you? Hey! The Rock Climbers Association was hundreds of members spanning over 35 countries worldwide. Hundreds of members growing and refining the art of rock climbing, pushing the craft to its absolute limit and beyond. Uh, I, I meant, if it's just the two of you, like here, what of it? Listen, kid. Climbing ain't for the weak of heart. Most people don't have what it takes. Um, it's not really that bad. So anyway, do you want to join the Climbers Club? Sure, why not? Great. We've got our third member. Not third, just another drop in the hundreds worldwide. All right, all right, anyway. So first things first. You've got you got a golden feather? Uh not yet. Oh. You can't climb without one. But you can buy them at the visitor centre. They should be pretty cheap. Come back when you bought one. Got it. We have another quest. We're well on our way on an adventure, folks. Oh, hello. Eh. I heard some rumors. Do you like rumors? Uh I dabble. <laughs> okay. Hear me out. Jim just bought a metal detector. He was running around yesterday, looking for stuff around the island. It was going nuts over. Seems like there's stuff buried all over the island. What kind of stuff? I don't know. Metal stuff? Alright, cool. So metal detectors on the mental list as well. Which I will undoubtedly forget. Until I'm able to actually purchase one. Uh, what's this way? Ooh, coins. Num, num, num. What's over here? A <gasps> uh, chest. Hop. Wah. Oh, no. Oh, I actually, I got them. That's fine. Oh, bestie. Oh, no. Um, hi. Howdy. How can I help you? 
Uh, I heard you sell golden feathers here. Oh, uh, we do. You can buy one for 40 coins. Uh, I don't know how much we've got. What else do you sell? Oh, we sell, we also sell provincial park mer merchandise. We're, we're kind of low on stock though. But that's good, actually. It's been a busy season. Provincial parks must be trending or something. Oh, it's possible. Anyway, we only have one hat left. It costs 100 coins. Uh, I'll pass. Thanks. When I have 100 coins, though, you better believe I'll be back. Howdy, what's up? Uh, I'd like to buy a golden feather, please. Sure. Here you go. Cha-ching. You found a golden feather. Let me explain how they work. If you press button zero while in midair, you can flap your wings for a double jump. But that's not all. To climb a wall, push against it and hold button zero. Hey. The more golden feathers you have, the more you'll be able to climb and fly. Have fun out there. Thanks. Bye. Oh, what's the signpost? Hello. Welcome to Hawk Peak Provincial Park. Enjoy a scenic trek to Outlook Point or follow Hawk Peak Trail up to the highest point in the province. Although this island is known for its titular mountain peak, it's also home to a number of beautiful beaches and forests. Did you know the infamous local dish, strawberries and toast, was invented here at Hawk Peak? That sounds amazing. Please join us at 5 p.m. to enjoy a delicious serving of this historical dish. Uh, I've, I, thanks. I, I misclicked. Thanks. Uh, wee. Oh no. Was that, was that my one use of my golden feather? Oh no, okay. It just, I just have to wait for it to recharge. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Please don't be a consumable. That would be awful. Uh, this is now Hawk Peak Trail, Sid Beach, and Shirley Point. Let's go to Hawk Peak. Ooh. Hawk Peak Trail. Notice, Hawk Peak Trail is a strenuous hike. You might need golden feathers to complete it. Golden feathers of so the visitor center. Got it. I got one. Swoosh. I wonder if like the more golden feathers I have, the more times I can double jump. Open. Give me them coins. What's in here? Whoa. Oh, hello, Mr. Fox. Hmm. Well, I was planning on hiking to Hawk Peak, but the path suddenly got real steep. Hmm. Do you think it's climbable? Well. I uh, would be if I had a golden feather. Apparently, there's some at the visitor center. Oh, so close. Did it recharge a second? What? What? There we go. Uh, Hog Peak Trail. That's what we want. Yum. A hole in the ground. <gasps> it's a it's a toy shovel. We found a toy shovel, folks. Oh, this is the life. Oh, there's a lighthouse. Oh no, it's just the boys, isn't it? Just them boys. Can I zoom in? No. Oh dear. Something very sparkly over there. Oh, I can zoom. Yeah, something very sparkly over there. Hopi Trail and Good Creek Path. Royal Ridge and Blackwood Trail. Hopi Trail. Hawk Peak Trail. This is very tunic. Oh, even the music. Hey all. How's the hike treating you? Oh, um, it's been nice. It's really beautiful here. <laughs> I know, right? The view from the top will be so good. Oh, you're going to Hawk Peak too? Oh, no. It's too intense for me. I'm just going to Outlook Point. Will I see you there? Uh, maybe I'll meet you at the top. Awesome. Catch you later. I'll undoubtedly go up there as well. Oh, no. That's... Suddenly got a bit louder. Oh no, don't fall in the water. You're a bad person. I need to... Sorry, friend. I need to... Sorry. Oh no, I fell in the river. 
Oh, he's nearly gone over there. Ooh, he's a gem. I mean, a shell. He's over here. Are there things? Are there secrets? More secrets? What's this? Oh. No, no, I can't destroy whatever that is. I think there might have been... Oh, it's that coin up there. I see. That's miles away, that is. Uh, I think I'm going the wrong way. Flap. Oh, it doesn't recharge when I'm in the air. That is interesting. Let's go this way. Not 100% sure where we're going now. There was no sign just there. Whoop. Oh dear, there we go. Hey yo. Hey yo. Yeah. Hawk Creek Trail, Good Creek Path, Meteor Lake. Mm hmm. Hawk Creek Trail. Oops. Ching. Ching. So I forgot reception yet. No. Mmm, money, 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 money. This was like a trap for a loot goblin like me. Where am I going? Oh, money, 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 money. Nom, 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 nom. What's this? The rubber flower. This unique sp uh, species blooms instantly in flash flooding conditions, inflating like a water balloon. Experience it yourself with one of the park's communal water buckets. All buckets are property of the park. Please do not remove the buckets from the park. Hmm. A bucket full of water seems heavy. I don't think I could fly or climb carrying a bucket full of water. But I could probably still glide. Oh, is it these? How do... How do... Uh, oh, no. I don't know how to empty this. Oh wait, hang on. There we go. Book full of water. It is this one. Oh, beautiful. Must go in there. Whoop. Uh. <laughs> now where? Oh no. Wee! I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> I didn't even flap. No. I've gone the wrong way and now I'm doomed. 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 <laughs> slowly, slowly. Oh, chest. Oh well, at least there'll be loot at the end of my life. <gasps> A golden feather. How exciting. So does that mean if I recharge both of them? <gasps> I can flap twice. Oh, that's so cool. Flap, flap. Whee. Uh, am I going down there? Are you sure? Oh, no. I slipped. <laughs> I caught the graphic. No, please let me grab onto this ledge. No. Oh, I don't, oh, what's that? There's a thing there. Is that a graveyard? Yum. Oh, no, I nearly missed that. What is this? Dear sign reader, do you like reading signs? I assume so, since this is happening right now. Uh, well, I can introduce you to something way better than reading. Two words. Parkour race. Parkour race. I'll be back right after I set up the finish line at the abandoned building. Avery. Nice. Is that the abandoned building, by chance? It looks pretty abandoned. There's a chest down there, which is cool. <laughs> Oh, 
Coin, coins. Yep, this is a graveyard. A rainy graveyard at that. I like that I'm I'm between two planes of weather there. <laughs> Well, let's not forget, we've also got our toy shovel as well. Oh, a lifeguard. And what looks like volleyball? Although I'm not certain. Wee. Although I'm back on the beach, so I wonder if... Oh, wait, do I still have my bucket? I do have a bucket. Sploosh. Sploosh. Mohaha. Boing. And I'm off. I don't know where I'm off to, but I'm off. What's going on here? Hi, friends. Coming in. Hi. Hey. Looks like you got the net set up. Are you two going to play volleyball? Volleyball? Nah. We invented our own game. I think it's going to be the next big thing. All right. Claire. Hmm? I formally challenge you to a game of beach stick ball. Ooh. That means you have to play. Yeah. You have to. It's the law. You can't fight the law. Okay, okay. I'll play. Yay. So, how do you want to play? Step over to the other side of the court, and I'll teach you everything you need to know. Are you ready? I can't get over the net. There we go. Hi. So, Beach Dick Ball has only three simple rules. Rule number one, hit the ball with your stick. Hit it real hard. Rule number two, don't let it hit the ground. I mean, for the most part. Uh, Julie's rough, so it's kind of up to her. It's all up to me. Rule number three, believe in yourself. That's the most important rule. That is the most important rule. Don't ever forget it. That's pretty much it. Are you ready? I guess so. The answer is no. You need to equip your stick first. Oops. Uh, how do you equip? Okay, there we go. Okay, ready, set, go. Boink. Might definitely hit the floor then. Oh, as if. That's how my wife always beats me at badminton. You lose. Did I lose? Nope. You can never lose. When you play beach stick ball, everyone wins. That's that's not how games work. <laughs> Except if you pop the ball, then I guess you lose. Otherwise, beach stick ball is a purely co-op game. You mean co-op game? Yeah, a coop game. <laughs> that's what I call co-op games. <laughs> it means we work together to get a high score. Oh, that sounds nice. We can get a point for every pass we make. If we get ten points, I'll give you a prize. I'm on. Let's go. We totally got this. Totally got this. Oh, I didn't get it. Went in the sea. Okay, 20 hits. Yes, we did it. As promised, I got a prize for you. Take this. Golden feather. You're really good. Hmm. I also want to give you a second prize, making it 20. I'm going to give you all the money in my pocket. Wow, god damn, I just robbed that guy. <laughs> wow, that's a lot. I don't want to take all your money. It's okay. My family's rich. Oh, well, okay. I'm going to just take this with me. I'm collecting sticks, don't you know? Bye. Oh, wait. Are you going to challenge me to another number? So, do you love it? Beastie Ball? Yeah, I like it. <laughs> Thanks for showing me the game. Thanks for playing. You're the best, Claire. You're right, bird person. I am the best, Claire. I like to think I'm the best, Claire. No matter all those other Claire's, I'm the best. Oh, I missed a thing. Sweet, sweet monies. Sweet moolahs. 
Money and steaks. What else could you ask for in an idyllic place like this? Ooh, that's uh, I tell you what I could ask for. Water. Uh, scoop and pour. Scoop and pour. Scoop and pour. Boing. Oh, there's another one there. Ooh, I wonder if I can... Oh, hello. Get the bucket. Pop it here. Pop it here. Whee! And away we go. <gasps> A tractor! That's iron. And some power lines as well, by the way. And a house. Can I go? I can't go in the house. Can I go? Ah, no! Don't, don't fall. I can't. I can't even see around the house. That's unfortunate. Oh, I can fly so high now. I can show you the world. Oh, I, can't, I really wish I had that shovel. I'm gonna go back and get that shovel. I'm gonna see if I can find that person from up on high. Can I find the person with the... Oh, there's a shiny there. Never mind the person. I want whatever the shiny is. I think it's just a coin. But now it's my coin. <laughs> That's the important difference. We Oh, a chest. There's so many things to pick up in this game. Oh, I've, I've not gone the wrong way. I'm just going the scenic route. If by scenic you mean you're a fan of stones, then it definitely seems very, very scenic. Yeah. Oh, so close. Oh, so close. No. Get out of the ocean. You're a bird, not a fish. More dollars. Can I get behind this waterfall? There's got to be... I'm sorry. Could I just climb that? Hello. A Rudinel. I had a brain fart then. I'm so sorry. Weirdly, it was hard to see the colour of your name against the black background. Don't change the colour of your name. <laughs> but I had a proper, proper moment then where my eyes were just like, you don't know what this word says, mate. Dear Sang Reader. Yeah, 100% accurate game. Bird like shines. Hi, I don't know you, but you're probably pretty cool. <laughs> I, I am, aren't I? <laughs> I like to think so. <laughs> I'm cool too. We should race each other. It would be cool. Burb. <laughs> I'm going to set up a ribbon at the lighthouse. Avery. Let's glide, people. We glide at midnight. Ooh, shinies. Mm, maybe I was a bird in a previous life. Who knows? It is always, however, the greed that gets me. Without a doubt. Oh, I've nearly got 15 shells. That's insane. <gasps> I wonder if I get another one. Another golden feather. Uh, there's going to be a marathon race at Meteor Lake today. The competition this year is fierce. Also can confirm, Mike is future black colorblind. I once saw him wandering around a black pink concert wondering where all the music was coming from. It's true facts. Nothing but true facts. Surround me with black and future. If I go to any sort of goth rave, I'm lost completely. Hey, what you painting? Oh. You can't tell. Uh, ooh. It's supposed to be the coastline. Awkward. Though... I'm trying to go for more of a abstract look. Ah, I think I see it now. It's still a work in progress, but I don't know if it's like, if I like where it's going. <laughs> Same. <laughs> I think I'm gonna head over to Blackwood Forest Lighthouse soon. I'm still trying to figure out the right inspiration. Wee! Show, 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 show. I'm glad I've got my inbuilt shoulder in uh, in uh, chat. Thank you very much, Bruce. Eh, coin. Coin me. Shell me and coin me. Wee! I can fly so high now. I can take over the world. I'm not joining your group yet. I've got a, a thing to do that's more important. Hello, frogface. 
<laughs> Check out the shovel I found. It might be a little more your size. <gasps> That's perfect. Let's trade. Yoink. I found a shovel. When you want to use my shovel, press button 3, the Y button, to open your inventory and equip it. Keep it fresh. Stay fresh, cheese bag. Uh, let's go for shovel. Equip. Shovel. Well, everyone get comfy. This is the stream. Uh, let's go here. <laughs> Parkour's a lot less stressful when you can fly. It's true. It's not wrong. They painted a yellow and purple yin yang symbol. <laughs> I just saw a melon. Uh, a, me a lemon, even. I always get those two, those two mixed up. It makes lemonade really awkward. I'm not gonna lie. And hard to make, too. Like, it's really hard to make. Hi. You got a golden feather? Yep. Great! So, to get started, you can try climbing this short wall here. Just push against the wall and hold button zero. I'm on. Nice one. Whatever! That climb is easy! Real pros use the big wall! Okay. Like that one. Whoa! Good climbing! Uh, it was all right. So, I know you can fly and all, but your stamina will last longer if you climb places instead. Just something to keep in mind. Cool. So what's next? Two hawk pig? Ah, okay. I still need to warm up myself. But I'll see you up there. All right. Let's go. Yum. Look out below! Oh, water! I need, I need water. I need a, my bucket. Where's my bucket? There's my bucket. No. Oh no! Equip my bucket. There we go. <laughs> water the rubber plant. Boing! Holy moly! There's trailers down there. Let's go. Boing! Whee. That's a massive bridge. Hi. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Do you have the time? Uh, yeah. Let me check. See. Normally, I would know the time. I've just lost my watch. Uh. Oh. Um. Sorry about that. It was very expensive. And priceless when you consider the sentimental value. I see. If you find it, can you bring it back to me? Uh, yeah, sure thing. Please don't sell it on the internet or whatever. It's very valuable to me. No, don't worry. I'll bring it right back. Okay. Thanks. Watch. You just lost a watch. I'm going to guess it's on the ground somewhere. You've lost a watch. You've lost your watch. Is it here? I don't need a bucket for that. Can I not swap items? There's no easy way to swap items. That's unfortunate. Oh, wait, no, there might be. Nope, D-pad doesn't do it. Fine. Equip. <laughs> I like that. Very swift. Turn as I dug that hole. Uh, I did have a random idea. I was thinking about doing this April 1st because I have free time and I'm usually bored. Put papers around in the woods. Oh god, it sounds like already sounds like a bad idea. Put papers around in the woods that just say random horror movie quotes and then put signs on the trees that say stuff like press left control to hide, press shift to run. <laughs> That's the best worst idea you've ever had. <laughs> Got another golden feather. Just al already sounded like you were trying to reenact like Slender Man or something. <laughs> Is this a... Where am I? Where am I going? The way forward is blocked. Okay, bye. <laughs> All right, it's been it's been fun. That could have just been a pop up, you know. Watch, 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 watch. Where is watch? I'm sure I'll find this watch somewhere around here. Wee. 
I bet it's up here somewhere. <gasps> Water! It's a, it's a web thing. A rubber one. You need HM flash first. Absolutely. It was damn dark in there. Do you know, on the subject of Pokemon, I was having a conversation with my friend uh, about uh, playing Game Boy games, original Game Boy games, on Nintendo Switch. And... I said, it's basically, it's only a matter of time. Now they've got original Game Boy games on Switch, it is only a matter of time before we get to replay on a handheld device that doesn't cost the Earth, I'm looking at you, Analog, which doesn't cost the Earth, um, to play original Game Boy games. Do you know the original game, original Pokemon Red in my local CEX, which is basically a charity shop, right? It's not. It's, it's essentially just where, people, where people's electronics go to rot and die. Um, until some brave soul like me comes and liberates it. Anyway, uh, it's like £90. It's ridiculous. Did I just try and climb a tree? And I'm not even sure its battery's intact. Oh, um, hi. Hi. <laughs> you okay there? Uh, not really. I'm supposed to run a marathon race here today, but I've lost my lucky headband. I've worn it for every race I've ever run. I I don't know if I can race without it. Well, where'd you lose it? Somewhere in Blackwood Forest. Hmm. I think... Well, I could take a look for you. Really? You'd do that for me? Sure. <gasps> Exclamation marks. It's a red headband. I can give you a reward. I like rewards. I can give you a pair of running shoes. Uh, don't you need those for yourself? Well, I just got sponsored by this shoe company. Oh, you're a, you're a marathon influencer. I see. And they gave me, like, ten pairs. Whoa. Congrats. Oh, uh, thanks. But uh, let me know if you see a red headband. I will do. What is this? Uh, Blackwood Forest? Blackwood Trail is north. Okay, cool. Uh, that's what happens. Hundreds of people who had a copy as a kid suddenly hit their nostalgic age and need a Pokemon Red, and that's uh, and there's one at the store with 500 buyers. Yep, exactly what it is. Do you know what really annoys me though? Is all of the stuff I owned before leaving my hometown. And the problem being, I left my hometown on very, very, very bad terms with my family, and all my stuff got binned. So I lost all my Silent Hill games, apart from like two. Silent Hill 1 and 2, which I kept I kept a grim death grip on. Why oh, can not turn the camera? What was uh, Yeah, all Game Boy games, all my N64 stuff, everything. That's why I've been recollecting stuff as I've uh, as I've grown up and gotten, you know, adult money. Which is why, if you are a member of the Discord, uh, and you will have seen some of my posts in the past, but I'm going to actually post some of the pictures, because I've got it all looking fancy now, so I'm probably going to post some pictures of it soon. Um, I need a bucket of my uh, of my retro game collection. I need to pour this on here, because I need to know where this goes. Boing! We going up here? Are we going in here? Am I going in here? No, I'm not. <laughs> God damn it. Like, I couldn't believe... I don't, I've got no problem going retro game hunting. I like retro game hunting. I think it's quite cathartic. Because um, I'm, I'm building that nostalgic... Oh, hello. Uh, Amanda VH2. Is that... That just reminds me. Firstly, welcome. I appreciate the follow. Um, I, that reminds me of the channel VH1. <laughs> that's all that's reminded me of. I'm so sorry. I don't know if that was the intent. But that's what, that's what that name was. Wow, why have I got such a zoned out view here? Let's go this way. I feel like I can go this way. Is this a shiny rock? Why is there a, why is there a shiny rock? Can I whack the shiny rock? Not the intent, but thanks. You're very welcome. <laughs> it's just, it's more me than you, trust me. It's just how my brain works. Oh, hello. I'm mining. <laughs> Arunel's mine immediately went, hmm, VHS was taken, so why not have VH2 or VH5? 
Wow, this is... Oh, okay, good. That's gone now. Good, good. I'm not gonna lie, that noise is kind of loud. Uh, what's down here? Oh, there's a chest. I have a chest. Must get chest. Don't dig holes in ground. Get chest. Don't dig holes. Get chest. Oh, I've... I've... I'm lost in the woods. Help. I'm, I'm lost. Oi, you. You've got that lucky red headband on. Come here. You cannot flee from me. Oh, uh, weird question. But where did you get that headband? Uh, uh -huh. I've had it for ages. Why? Uh, well, I was just talking to this rabbit. She said she lost a headband somewhere in the forest. Oh, you mean Sue? Uh, maybe. I didn't get a name. She was really worried about it, though. She said it was lucky and she needs it for a race. I'm supposed to race her later today. She's so talented. I've been really looking forward to it. Hmm. What if I gave you mine? I'm pretty sure it's the same kind. Maybe she wouldn't notice. Oh, um, but then it wouldn't be lucky. Ah, I don't know. Just take it. See if she wants it. Okay. I don't know if I want to give her an unlucky headband. What's over here? Uh, oh, hello. Hey. Yes, this setup is 100% legal. Uh, yes, I have a valid camping permit. Wait, fine, fine, you got me. Hold on. I lost it. I'm a terrible liar. <laughs> I'm a mess. Uh, please don't write me up. I can bribe you. Cheers, I didn't need a bribe. Uh, did you really just hand me a fistful of worms? It's fishing bait. I'm desperate. What would you do? Well, uh, yeah, it probably doesn't matter. I'm not going to tell anyone. Wait, really? Aren't you like a junior ranger? <laughs> no. My aunt's a ranger, uh, but I don't work for her. Oh, well, you won't tell, right? Nah, good, I guess. Yeah, you can keep the bait. Thanks. Why'd you lose the permit? Well, you, you might not believe me. Try me. A fish ate it. What? Come on. Really? It does sound a little fishy. Oh, I need that noise on my sound look. <laughs> this is serious. Sorry for freaking out earlier. I've been on edge ever since I lost my permit. The thought of being accused of camping without a permit, that's the ultimate nightmare. Yeah, that's that's the ultimate nightmare. That's that's absolutely my ultimate nightmare. In the world we live in right now, that's the worst thing that could possibly happen. Boing, boing, boing. Ooh, a, ge a, a gem. A coin. <laughs> I can't help it. I've been online longer than the internet. Fun fact, it's always been porn. D&D &D and cat pictures. <laughs> That's true. Plus music and movies. People got creative. In the old days, you download The Stand Part A, one of 20, and all the other files, and then use copy command, uh, copy and B command to build the combined... Yeah, I, I used to do that as well. Uh, build the combined file from all the pieces, and then watch a 240p video of an old movie you could buy on DVD for five bucks. It's amazing how inventive folks can be to save five dollars. Yeah, yeah. I used to remember, um, uh, what is it? You had to build your own files, basically. Meteor Lake Overlook, Hawk Peak Trail, Blackwood Trail. I remember, Pepperidge Farm remembers. I remember that. I need some water, like, near me. Preferably where I can float to. Water? No water. Water? No water. Oh, hello. I win! Yay! Can I stay at this? No. No, I cannot vandalize the uh, finish line of a race. Oh my god, what's going on here? Is this the marathon? Hey, are you doing the race today? Yeah, I'm kind of busy right now. What do you want? Uh, I don't want to join the race right now. Definitely 100% don't want to join the race. 
Ah, water. Uh, ah, this is... Oh, no, this is someone completely different. I was like, this is where uh, the lifeguard was. Nope, it's not. Any more gems? Any more gems? <gasps> A chest. Side note, the internet uh, where I was... Where I was was 10 cents a minute. So I often spent over $50 downloading a $5 movie at half DVD quality. Hell yeah. Do you know the very first thing I ever downloaded? If you if you are allowed to say, and you remember, and it's, you know, relatively safe work, uh, what was the first thing you ever downloaded? This is an open question to everyone in chat. What was the first thing you downloaded on the internet? Because I remember what I first downloaded on the internet. And it is safe for work. It's incredibly nerdy, but it's safe for work. Hey, frog. I'm so stoked to eat breakfast. But it's already the afternoon. Tomorrow's breakfast. That's like me. The best meal of the day. Sometimes when I'm about to go to bed, I get so excited by the thought of I have trouble sleeping. I mean, I don't normally have trouble sleeping because I'm excited for breakfast. I gotta admit. Normally it's because of what I had for dinner, but that's a that's another story. Hop. Oh, I can go up here. Oh, hello. Can I move this? I can. How exciting! Oh, poo. I'm gonna leave you all in deep suspense now, wondering what the first thing was I downloaded on the internet. My first download was right-clicking and saving the first 1,000 strips of questionable content to put on a USB stick for my older brother who had no internet. <laughs> that's a that's a that's a gift. That is that really is. Uh, but here in rural Maine, getting a movie was nearly impossible. No Amazon, no Sears, what a joke. I had to join those CD clubs where they sent you random overpriced CDs and you waited uh, for a sale on the decent ones, hoping to get it before it was cancelled. I remember, I'm when you, I, I'm of the age where you would go to Blockbuster Video and you wouldn't always have a choice of what movie you got to watch because some people are like oh i'm so old that netflix used to post out movies that was that was new age stuff right you honestly don't remember uh it was in hs sometime i think it was a game demo probably that's fair enough that's that's a good shout mine this is open to everyone as well feel free to answer uh mine i downloaded the theme tune to buffy the vampire slayer that was the first thing I ever downloaded because I was obsessed with it at the time. Oh, gone feather. Yes! And an invisible step. How exciting. Uh, and that two minute song, if that actually, not even that, the theme tune, took four hours to download. That's, that's good internet, so that is. Yeah, that was the very first thing I downloaded. It's not the first thing I looked at. I can't tell you what the first thing I looked at was. Um, yeah, it was it was Buffy the Vampire. The theme tune to Buffy the Vampire's like, what is that? Oh, well, that's your that's your line, isn't it? Sorry, I was about to get myself caught by a fisherman. Um, so I go there. Boop. Is there another one of these? Yeah, so that got me that. What's this way? Oh, oh no! Oh, I'm done. Slide. I slide. I was on a ton of group chats and stuff for years before I had a computer I could download. Uh, 808 PCs <laughs> don't exactly have the capacity to do porn or something. No, ASCII porn has a lot to has a lot to answer for. Has a lot to uh, be be. Uh, I, can't even, I don't even know the words I was trying to use then. It's a it's a refined taste. Is uh, ASCII? I was too young to remember it anymore. It booted off a floppy and it had a modem drive on, on disc two. <laughs> I do remember my very first PC having a whopping one gigabyte hard drive. It could fit Windows and Dungeon Keeper and nothing else. 
That's exactly what I had on my PC. <laughs> my very first PC. And it was a hand-me-down from my uncle. And to be honest, I've never built from scratch my own PC. Ever. Ever. I've always had... I've always either purchased one... Like, there's one I'm using right now. Purchased it off a co-worker. It was, I think, 200 quid. And it had a decent graphics card, decent CPU. Uh, I've since upgraded the graphics card and the RAM and everything like that, so... You remember downloading all of Weird Al's songs on LimeWire and a copy of Daily Identical. LimeWire's got a lot to answer for. LimeWire's the reason why our generation is so security conscious with IT. <laughs> I, I like to think. It's such a, such a golden lesson. Oh, Hoppy Tram. We need a stream view building the whole thing. Well, if a company wants to send me PC parts out, I'll do it. <laughs> but though, that stuff's expensive, man. Like real expensive. I'm I'm happy to do that. Um but yeah, I it's it's weird as well because I know how to build a PC because I've watched so many tutorials on it. But I just have never built my own PC. I've only ever had one PC that has just been added to here and there. Uh I was sent out when I was streaming on GOG, um I was sent out a PC as part of a promotion and I basically used that i didn't have a pc before that that could be do i not get to oh i do get to go somewhere oh, lovely i'm frozen i'm sorry what i'm freezing now um yeah i was i was lucky enough to get sent out a pc and it was a it was a big pc right it was a, a big beastly pc um so that was a lot of my uh a lot of my thing but it was a rental essentially i had to look after it i had to keep it ticking over um it constantly had to be ready to be shipped back so i never actually had my own pc probably until this one to be honest with it i'm there's just here but again that was a co-worker purchase so hoppy trail at least seven golden feathers are required to complete the hike okay that's fine uh, novice hikers should consider using more hey kid you want to buy some golden feathers? Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> cool. It'll be 100 coins per feather. But that's more than twice as much as a visitor center. Go buy feathers from them then. Maybe I will. Hmm. So you're going to buy my feathers or what? How much money have I got? 300. Uh, yeah, why not? All right, pay up. Ching! Got another golden feather. I got six. Smell you later. I wonder if we can do it with six. I know we're not going to be able to. Jump! Yes! Oh my god, I'm frozen to death. I am legit frozen. I see water. Oh, it's a hot spring. I see. Uh, LimeWire. Ugh, I spent the early 2000s reinstalling Windows on my brother's PC. <laughs> Probably because of LimeWire. <laughs> I'm going to freeze <gasps> A polar bear. Hello. Mm, hold on there, young friend. I hope you don't mind me saying, but you seem a little unprepared. It's mighty cold up here for folks who aren't accustomed. I didn't expect it to get this cold. My feathers are freezing up. Hawk Peak is unique in the province for geothermal activity. If you get too chilly, stop at one of the hot springs. That should give you your strength back. Thanks, friend. Can I just stand near your fire? Thanks. Let's go this way. 100% won't be able to do this for six. But you never know, right? Oh, no. I nearly, I nearly fell into nothing. I'm so nervous about getting stuck in glitches and bugs. I don't want to I don't want to break a game. I mean, I like breaking games. Don't get me wrong. It's... The, the software tester in me is still happy to break games. Bloop! Oh, the, there was a cave there. There's a cave. Yum. What's through here? Nothing. That's through there. Me having a drink of water. <sighs> oh, my feathers are starting to freeze. Sploosh! Yeah, like, weirdly, I've built more PCs than I care to count. 
because I used to work on uh, essentially a PC maintenance team for a previous company and we just used to physically build PCs for people but they were like workstation PCs so they were cack <laughs> essentially they were rubbish um, but yeah I'm I'm more than happy to do that but the problem being is it's bloody expensive what is this why is oh no oh no oh no I've, I've done it wrong there can I not just jump up here is this not a thing warm me up oh, yeah. warm me up buttercup there we go. Oh, right. As soon as I use them, they freeze. Oh, I see. I see. Icy. Get it? It's icy. Um, um, so where's the nearest? Ah. Where's the nearest hospital from here? Right, so as the minute I use them... Oh, I don't think I've been up here. Have I been up here? Yes, I have been up here. Um, let's be sh so now as soon as I use them... Yeah, they still freeze. Okay. Is there a way without jumping? Oh my god, what's through here? Oh my god. Is this journey all of a sudden? Hut, 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 hut. Hut, 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 hut. Hello, Foxy. Hey, it's you again. We're almost to the top. But it looks like the bridge collapsed. Hmm. There might be another way up. Or I could just go collect more golden feathers. There might be an other an other way up. How do other way up? Is there a oh, what's that? Yo fly. Hello? You're an updraft thingy, aren't you? Uh, where's my shovel? Oh, that's not going to work, is it? I need something explosive to get through that. Okay. Whee! Let's head back down. Oh, a chest! Loot! Loot, I tell you. Mm. Mm -hmm. Delicious loot. Go, go this way. This is the way I want you to go. My feathers are still frozen. They're still frozen. Oh no, they're not frozen anymore. I'm just out of stamina. Okay. What's that? <gasps> the top of the building. <gasps> Another chest. Yes. So much loot. Ooh. Ooh, my first PC was a Zenith 8086 PC. I dug out of a bin when the UMain upgraded their computer lab with uh, 286 machines. I bought a math coprocessor co for it, uh, which is which is what the 8088 was apparently. Just an 8086 with a math with a math coprocessor. Co I can't speak. Uh, upgraded 8086. It didn't have a socket. Uh, I had to dismantle the whole thing and solder the socket onto the motherboard. Then I could plug it in. Uh, second PC was a 286 from the same lab five years later when they went to 386. Third was a mail order PC assembly class that included a 386SX from Cyrix. I know most of those. Don't get me wrong. I You lost me a little bit with the details there, but I do know oh, there's a... Oh, no, I don't. Just go to the abandoned building. Oh, no, I screwed up. There we go. Uh, yeah, I know what most of those are, but you uh, you did lose me a little bit with the numbers. However, uh, I appreciate... I used to love the um, really big sort of beige towers that you used to get back then. I always had a soft spot for beige towers. I think you were probably two or three when I made the idea. Yeah, that's fair. I was uh, feeding jam sandwiches to a ZX Spectrum. Or an Amstrad CPC. Ah. 
Uh, I, Bruce says, I'm still using Memphis PC. I built it in 2013 and have since upgraded most of the bits from things friends and housemates were getting rid of. Uh, I had no idea what's in it anymore. That's a good PC. That's a, that's a tradition. Now, that's a traditional PC. Um, yeah, that's a, I think now it's just, no, no, before the Zenith, not sure it counts, but I had a Coco 10 from Radio Shack. God. I only know what some of these are. That was back in the tape drive days. I only know what some of these are because of um, uh, lazy game reviews. Because LGR finds these weird and wonderful old tech, I now know what this what this stuff is. I used to use, in a previous job, I used to use a brilliant, absolutely stonking terminal machine. I cannot remember what it is, but all it did was displayed green text on a black background and it was just a finance system that's all it was <gasps> oh i found a treasure map what treasure map is less of a map and more of a bunch of riddles read it says south of the stone tower across the river bridge a lonely seat sits crumbling upon the royal ridge oh okay <gasps> a, a chest a feather! Seven feathers. Right, what was that riddle again? It says, south of the stone tower across the river bridge. So, that way, yeah. Uh, a cheap $100 knockoff of a Commodore on clearance 25 bucks. <laughs> a lonely seat sits crumbling upon the royal bridge. So, south of that way. I, I, j I know I actually can't turn the camera, can I? That's unfortunate. Whoop. Let's go this way. Wee. Is there a bridge? Can I see a bridge? Flap. Can I see a bridge? Can I see a bridge? Flap. Is that a bridge? Is there anything crumbling over here? No. Flap. Oh, God. Oh, God. There's a bridge. Flap. There's no crumbling seat though, which is unfortunate. Oh, maybe there is. Is this a seat? Nope. Um, what? What about if it's out to sea? Nope, that's an invisible wall. Is that why ducks quack when they're flying? They're just yelling flop, flop, flopping duck. True. It's absolutely true. I've had this conversation with my wife before when we go out uh, walking. Also, there's no such thing as geese. Um, they're just what I call duck pluses. Uh, and there's no such thing as swans because they're duck plus pluses. <laughs> they're just leveled up ducks. They're all ducks, all of them. I'm telling you. Uh, right. Royal. Something royal. Something to do with royalty. What am I doing? I think this hole is what I'm doing. God damn it. Damn it. Diggy hole. There we go. Is it... Where am I going? Is it... Oh, I didn't know. No. Wait, what was that? That's a fire. Fire! No, I don't think there's anything back there. Royal something? Good trail, good creek trail. Royal Ridge. Let's go Royal Ridge. <gasps> a shell, a shell. <laughs> Intercept the shell. It ducks all the way down. It is ducks all the way down. She finds it equally amusing and annoying when I say duck pluses. Hmm, I wonder where the lighthouse is. What? what? Oh, that's because I've read that sign. Got it. <laughs> a crumbling seat, you say. A crumbling seat. So this is, is this Royal Ridge? Am I, oh, another shell. Is that enough? Oh, that's way more than enough. Then go get the shells to the girl. Uh, right. But, so this is, this is the lighthouse, right? No, this is a tower. Don't be stupid, Smith. 
Um, a crumbling seat. Where is El Crumble CTO? People are just weird ducks with no feathers or wings. <laughs> Dig. No, that's a stick. You can't dig with a stick, silly. Money! So... Uh, south of Stone Tower, across the river bridge, a lonely seat sits crumbling upon the royal witch. I did see a seat earlier in one of those spyglass things. I'm just not sure where it is. So Royal Ridge is left at this point. It's this way. And without getting too distracted by shells, I'm going to keep an eye out for anything. Well, that's definitely the edge of that. I'm going to keep an eye out for stuff. Oh, maybe a flap. It's over here? No, I see what it is over here. A hole in the ground. Hole in the ground. Secrets to be found. <gasps> Another shell. Oh, I nearly attacked the shell with the shovel then. Is this a chest? That's a chest. That's a chest. Now I can flap to my heart's content. Give me money. Uh, yeah, I'm certain I found one. Right, where's where's the 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 shell lady? Where's where's Shelly? Where's Shelly Mary? Um You're not here. Shells? Sh look at you go. Look at you. My sandcastle is now part of the sand city. <laughs> and also, I'm running into a hotly contested election for mayor. Oh, hold on. There's a siren I was talking about. The election was also just coming in. <gasps> okay, okay. I'm tallying them up. <gasps> Third place? What? I built this city. <laughs> this is a very clever game. <laughs> I like this. Like, a crumbling seat. I mean, I'm, I'm certain I saw a crumbly tower, a crumbly building. Excuse me. Where's the... Oh, wait. Did, was it you that wanted shells? Hang on. Come back. Thanks for lending me the compass. I'll get it back to you when I'm done on my hike. Oh, nah. Just keep it. You know what they say. It's good luck to know which way is north. Uh, do they say that? Actually, I'm not sure. But it certainly can't be bad luck. Boing. Boing. So now we have returned to where we were originally. Where is the shell girl? Are you the shell girl? No, you're the headband lady though. These sides are so slippery. Any luck finding my headband yet? Well, I found this. Hmm, that's not it. The sweat stains aren't in the right place. Ugh. Where did you find this? Actually, a turtle gave it to me. They said that you could have it. They're looking forward to the race and didn't want you to miss it. What? Really? Taylor the turtle? They're like the regional champion. This headband has to be like at least twice as lucky. Possibly even quadruple lucky. <gasps> I'll take it. I'm so pumped. Take these running shoes. Ding. Now I can run. However, you have to keep in mind that running requires golden feathers. Boost. After all I heard was running. <laughs> I stopped. Oh, a golden feather. How exciting. Um, right, where's. Was it you that wanted shells? Hello. Excuse me. Excuse me. Wait, where's that? Nothing. That's what that is. That was a. That was a nothing. That was a graphic. Hello. Wait, uh, how do I glide again? No. Where is, where is, oh, uh, water. <laughs> Boing. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, it's you. You're now pitching tail instead of the tail, and it's amazing. <laughs> well, that's because they didn't just hand me their headband. They had to shake it off. You are all welcome for that one. That's a freebie. You're all welcome to it. Hello. Excuse me. Hello. Hey, I got your shells. <gasps> Ooh, I'll take them. So now what? What? I mean, uh, do I get anything? No. Jeez, not even a thank you. That's not very nice. I do what it takes to survive, man. I never promised you anything. Ooh. Actually, I do have something for you. A new job. I already have a job. Well, make this your side gig. <laughs> what if I don't take it? It's your loss. Good jobs are hard to find. We're in a racket here. <laughs> so will it be? Uh, go on, I'll take your side gig. Good. Take this. Shell necklace. <laughs> and deliver it to Ranger May. That is all. Huh. <laughs> you physically pushing me away. <laughs> Boing. Whee. Are you Ranger May? I never asked. I've got a delivery. It's from Jen. Ding! <gasps> wow, it's so pretty. She's such a sweet girl. Collecting all those shells must have been a lot of work. Yeah, well, she outsourced it. Well, actually, hmm? Nah, never mind. Oh. I remembered something. I found this golden feather in the cabin. Oh, we're swimming in golden feathers. I figured you could use it. We're 100% going to go to the peak now. Well, thanks. This is weird timing. This is like a reward for delivering the necklace? Uh, no. Huh. Tiny bit of fourth wall breaking there. Oh, there's a there's a sand castle. Why is there a sand castle here? Can I make a sand castle? No, I can't make a sand castle. What is this? Is this a, just a rock? It's just a rock. Sometimes a rock is just a rock. That's a very hard sand castle. It's a very, very hard sand castle. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, water. Water. Can I, I wonder, put water on the campfire? Not to be horrible, but is that a thing I can do? Yes. It is pretty hot out. I guess we don't really need a fire right now. I'm such a bully. <laughs> I didn't want that fire in the first place. I didn't spend ages making it. Oh my god, it came back on immediately. Jeez, can you, can you... Show me how to do that. I had to try and start a fire recently, an actual log fire. It was amazingly difficult. <laughs> Whee. I mean, I did it, don't get me wrong. There's nothing quite as uh, satisfying as making fire, but another shell. Whee. I've never felt so manly in my life. And I, sh I do strongman training. <laughs> I was just like, I've made fire. Like, I've made fire. Uh, brought by ants. They vomit into the sand so they're carrying to make it all sticky. That's why ant hills are as hard as cement. Interesting. That There's something I did not know nor wanted to know. But now I know. That's a good pub fact, that is. The next time I'm in the pub with people and someone mentions an ant, I'm going to go, do you know the funny thing about ants? Boing. Right, let's go up here. I don't think there's any others here. Oh, camera shift. No, oh, we are just... We just have superpowers now. Whee! I'm still confused by that riddle. But I'm not confused enough to go digging for it, if that makes sense. Hop. Oh, what's over there? Uh, it's a, it's the boat we went on with the captain. With your old mate, captain. You've made fire with sticks, rocks, you name it. It's hella hard. Like, holy crap, Cub Scouts in the 80s. <laughs> yeah, that's fair enough. Like, Cub Scouts in the 80s, of, well, from what I know, anyway, Cub Scouts in the 80s will train you for, like, the, the like, apocalypse. To be honest with you. Oh, no. Oh, I've crashed. Oh, no. Well, that didn't go according to plan, but I'll be honest, I didn't have a plan to begin with, so. 
E. Right. Um. Wait. I wonder if the hat would keep me warm. I think he had a hat, didn't they? Where is the hat? Okay, hat man. Ski babu dabu doop. Dabu dabu doop. Ski babu dabu doop. There's a lighthouse. I always find the lighthouse is very slightly ominous due to World of Horror. Oh look, we've got 10, 10 golden feathers now. I'm just gonna fly out of here and fly home. <laughs> no reason for me to be here anymore. Where is, I could do the map, to be honest. Where is the visitor's centaur? I require your visitor's centaur. Fetch me your half man, half horse, specifically for visitors. Uh, I saw something over here. Oh, it's a shell. Got it. Ching. Also wove rope from grass and bark. Made a canoe from sticks and birch and sap. Made a bow and shot a squirrel out of a tree and ate it. Our den leader nowadays would have been considered a prepper. You just... Are you... Rude now. You don't have to say this if it's confidential. Are you Rambo? Is that, is that what's going on here? Or is that one of those things you can neither confirm nor deny? I was 100% certain I was going to get electrocuted then. Are you Rambo? Like Rambo Rambo. Like actually Rambo. Like John Rambo from the Rambo movies. Because I'm pretty sure he could do all that stuff. You sound badass. I'm not going to lie. Like, legit. Ah, pickaxe! How exciting! I don't, I don't know I, how to uh, <laughs> put it away. Uh, pickaxe. Well, now I know where I'm going. <laughs> you wish he's rich. <laughs> so that's the only thing. Great, cool. So the only thing separating you from John Rambo is his money. Cool. <laughs> If I ever, ever do a meet and greet, a rude note, I would like you to be at least five or ten steps away from me because I feel like you would be big enough to crush me with one hand. <laughs> Is it this one I saw the, the ruined thing out of? What are you doing over there? Burying evidence is what you're doing. He made movies. I made Undercooked Squirrel. My whole pack had to get the rabies shot. Ah, a poisoner, I see. <laughs> I like it. A fine weapon of choice. Let's go. What's this? Is this lookout tower? Is this Firewatch all of a sudden? Are we playing Firewatch? Are we playing Do You Copy? God, that's a game I've not heard of in a while. <laughs> Lighty house. And not a lot else. Whoop. Uh, so apparently I've stopped looking for the thing, the visitor center, because I forgot, I'll be honest. <laughs> Hi, bye. Hello. Oh, hey. Uh, it seems like you've really gotten the hang of climbing. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Uh, um, I think I'm stuck. Tim, it's too high. What have I done? I can't do this. Tim. Take a deep breath. Try and remain calm. You're doing great. And you know you can handle this. Can I? What am I doing? Just focus on the next step. You've got this. I've got this. I've got this. Yep, he's got this. I, I believe in Tim. Boop, boop. Warm me up, walk up. Uh, now, 
How can... No, that's... That's not how you do that. Are there any other ways up? Oh, I vaguely remember. I, I yeah, I just completely had... Oh, can I climb this bit? Yes, I can. I completely had a, a brain fog moment then. Come on, go. Oh no, I wasted everything then. Curses. Whop. Now I'll go to this bit. Use my newly acquired pickaxe. Yes. Oh, it's a spring, of course. I thought it was going to be like a, a torrent of air. Um, I'm just from a generation who would jump off bridges because it was too damn hot on the pavement. <laughs> Yeah, we hung out on old railroad bridges. I've even jumped a boxcar a couple of times to hitch to hitch to Bangor uh, to go and get to go to the mall. Wow, I'm just a typical rural Maine kid. Rural Maine kids sound tough as nails. Uh, lots of free time, not a lot to do, and not a whole lot of brains. <laughs> Way more luck than brains. Well, I appreciate you being here, and I appreciate you sharing these stories with us. Mom didn't have a car, so my grandfather would get occasional phone calls. He's in Bangor. Can you go get him? <laughs> you were uh, as yeah, you, you as much of a troublemaker as I was, to be honest with you. <laughs> Although I was a bit of a not like a shut in, but I didn't do a lot of outdoorsy stuff like that. But there was a time when we'd I'd leave the house, especially in summer, like the summer holidays. Leave the house first thing in the morning on the summer holidays. Don't come back until it's dark, basically. And I think that was our parents' reprieve. Oh, there's no water. Curses. That's a hell of a... Bang in North Wales. That's a hell of a trip. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think that was like our parents' vacation from us. To be honest with you. And wallop. Right, let's see if we can make it. Oh. Oh no, don't, don't do that. I don't know where I'm going. What the, <laughs> camera? <laughs> God damn it, camera. <laughs> what did I do to deserve that? <laughs> don't swap, don't swap fucking camera angles now. There we go, jeez. Wow. Whew. I... I did it. <laughs> yeah, we did. That was Northern Lights. beautiful at some point we are um i'd love to go to <laughs> i'd love to go to iceland and see the northern lights it's one of my one of my bucket list items is to see the northern lights <gasps> cell phone reception hello hi claire mom i'm so glad to hear from you i've been waiting all day to hear from you i've been worried why do i pick how do i pick these games oh honey i told you i'd be fine yeah, but you always say that, and I always am. Anyway, how have you been? Well, I'm on the top of Hawk Peak right now. Ooh, wow. I love it up there. May and I used to go up there every summer together. It's about time you made it up. Yeah, I know. You're so big now. My little girl's leaving the nest. You won't have any need for little old mom. But I do need you. I'll never not need you. When I heard about the surgery, how come you never told me this was a thing? Oh, I didn't want you to worry. But I know you can get worked up about things. I could have been there for you. You're all alone there now. Really, it was nothing. Everything was fine. I'm just glad you're okay. I love you, Mom. 
I love you too. Wait. Something's happening. What is going on? Was that the famous Hawk Peak updraft? Uh, it looks like it. You should catch a ride on it now, before it fizzles out. I I wanna, but I'm kind of nervous. Claire, you can do it. I'll come visit you soon, okay? Also, don't forget to say hi to Aunt May for me. She's probably waiting for you back at the cottage. Bye. Love you. Love you too, Mum. Right, let me just reheat my wings. How I I do seem to pick these games, don't I? Wee! Look at this! Look at us go! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> I didn't make it. I didn't move any direction, so it slammed me into the ground. <laughs> I don't think that was what was intended. <laughs> Boing. <laughs> now I gotta find the cottage again. <laughs> I think it was this way. <laughs> ah, nothing like a. Uh, nothing ruins a serene, peaceful moment like an idiot streamer who doesn't know what he's doing. <laughs> Stop changing the camera angle. Oh no, it's so it's not this way. Okay. I think it's back here. I think this is the weird island I went to. Mm. Yeah, I have a feeling I could have explored like the whole island from that updraft, but, but your boy didn't know, so <laughs> it's raining, yeah? Why is it raining here? Can I just go up here? Is it up here? Oh, it is. I'm not gonna lie, I'm lost. There's a there's a tree there though. I could have used that, but I don't have any water on me. Let's go this way. Choom. Flap. Quack. Quack. Oh, a, a chest. Oh no, I want the chest. Precious few coins. Oh, there was a shell. Oh, don't leave the shell but No shell left behind. Zero shells left behind, people. It's so stormy all of a sudden. And now where am I? Oh, I'm in that ruined place. Oh, the ruins were the... Cemetery, got it. So where now I'm totally lost. I don't I don't think this is the ending the game wanted me to have. Well this is the, the experience the game wanted me to have to slam my face into the floor the second I leave the top of the mountain. But it it looks like it was gonna take over in a nice cinematic cutscene and then I realised it was just the camera being my mortal enemy. Always the camera in these games. Mm. Boing. Exactly, I got trolled by the updraft. <laughs> I got absolutely launched into the floor. It, it legitimately looked like I was going to have a nice, lovely cutscene where it was going to fly around. Because the minute I took off, it changed direction. The camera changed, I changed direction, the whole nine yards, and then all of a sudden, I was just kissing the floor. <laughs> no, I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> I'm trying to find the cottage again. I think it might be up here. Wait, Ranger's Cottage. Where's Ranger's Cottage? Hoppy Trail, notice. Yeah, no, cool, got that. Yep, golden feathers. I got plenty of those, friend. So it's down this path then. Uh, visit center. Shirley's, Shirley's point. Where's Shirley's point? I don't know any part of Shirley. 
uh, this way. Let's go this way. It smells like it's going to be this way. Hmm. Oh, hello. Oh, wowzers. Look at you go. Whoa. The sea has really been growing, huh? Oh, this isn't a sand city anymore. It's a sand province. This time, I'm running for premier, for premier in the provincial elections. Sure, I wasn't elected as mayor. But this time, I'm really doubling down on outreach. And I'm promising policies I really think will resonate with my key districts. Once I'm elected, I'll be able to use my provincial influence to fully exert control over the city that shunned me. <laughs> uh -huh. Wow. And the first legislation I'll pass to exi will exist to consolidate my allies in Parliament. The second legislation, free candy for everyone. <laughs> Uh-huh. Ow. How's the campaign going? Super good. Lovely. Eh, there we go. I imagine that updraft was actually a troll fart. He's <laughs> under the bridge at the bottom of the mountain. I mean, it was very bubbly. So I was a bit, you know, dubious about it. Where am I going? It's around here somewhere. I'm certain of it. I am almost certain of it anyway. Let's get some height. Come. Frog gets my vote. Frog gets my vote, dude. Absolutely. I'd vote for him. Uh, ah. It's near here. I remember this bit. We. It's here, in fact. Now, where can I land? That'll do. Perfect. 10 out of 10. Where's my pickaxe? What? Give over. Hi, Aunt May. Hey. Did you make it to the top? Yeah. It was really nice. I can see why you like it so much. No, it wasn't exactly a short hike. I'm really tired. <laughs> well, maybe that was a bit of an understatement. Only a bit? It's kind of been a busy day. Oh, yeah? What have you been up to? Well, I don't mean to brag, but I think I became the beach stickball world champion today. What's beach stickball? <laughs> it's going to be the next big thing. It's like volleyball, but with a stick. I'd play that. Also, I whacked my shovel against this rock, and money came out of it. It was a money rock. Well, now you're just making stuff up. I highly doubt you found a money rock in Ontario. They're more of a West Coast thing. Oh, I found a secret shortcut through the mountain. You mean you got through the blocked tunnels? That's very dangerous. They were blocked off for a reason. <laughs> uh, whoops. Claire. Anywho, are you hungry? I'm going to break out the hot dog soon. Well, I kind of tired out. I'm going to go take a nap or something. All right, then. Have a good one. Nap time. I think it'd be nice to take a break. Sleep. Alrighty. It's nap time. <laughs> the end. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> that was a short hike. I really enjoyed that. I feel like I could definitely spend more time doing stuff in that game. Ouch, this poor frog. Uh, he makes a sandcastle, then a city, and they all shun him. It's like having a wonderful dream, except everything happens and everyone, everything happens to everything, everyone around you, like you're a background character in your own dreams or something. That's harsh. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for playing. You're welcome, game. You're more than welcome. Brilliant. Excellent stuff. I really enjoyed that. Really, really enjoyed that. Right, I'm going to do a quick outro for YouTube and then we're going to swap games. <clears throat> hey everyone. So, that was a short hike, which was a little more than a short hike, um, but we had a lot of fun along the way. We discovered some shortcuts, 
we found some money rocks and we made a friend in a possible frog dictator who at least is going to give candy to everybody but that's going to be it for a short hike and undoubtedly i'll go back to it at some point um just to find all of the secrets so maybe i'll make another video on that now if you liked this video please consider liking it if you dislike it then there's a dislike button and if you want to support the channel for free you can by using the subscribe button and it really does help but for now stay chill stay safe and i'll see you in the next lo-fi gaming thanks very much already that's my sexy outro done cool what now what should i play um how long have i got i've got an hour and 10 minutes what can we play an hour and 10 minutes a short hike. Most polite game. End screen is like, hey, thanks. <laughs> Cheers. Thanks for that. Uh, we're going to play in an hour and 10 minutes. <gasps> I know I can play in an hour and 10 minutes. It's also weirdly lo fi. Come on, load. Yes. This is mouse and keyboard. Effect. But fortunately. Yeah, I'll turn that down a bit while I do a YouTube intro. Quick game of Civ 5. No. <laughs> I don't trust myself with Civ games. I never have, and I never will. I would make a game that took 21 hours to finish just long enough, and the end credits would be like, hey, thanks for your money, schmuck. Now you can't refund the game. You have 21 hours played, so good for you, just because it'd go viral as hell for sure. And then it gets a ton of publicity from streamers trying to buy it, beat it, and refund it. Oh, you absolutely know that people would find glitches in it. I mean, those glitches, you'd have to then patch those glitches out, but absolutely speedrunners would find glitches in it. I'm just going to move my microphone a second, and then we're going to do a youtube intro so if you want to say hi youtube you say hi youtube there we go. how loud is that that's that's better hey everyone welcome back to lo-fi gaming probably the chillest place on the internet to find gameplay now today we're revisiting one of my absolute favorites save room now i found this a while ago on gog and i i couldn't believe this actually existed it's a really obscure little puzzle game where you sort out the inventory items for an action adventure character and that sounds crazy and it sounds like it wouldn't be very interesting but it's a really nice puzzle and it kind of blends all of the stuff about things like resident evil games and stuff like that that i really really enjoy it's the inventory management side of things it's a bit of a wild ride but i uh, i hope you are on board with it so if you like this video please consider liking it if you don't like it there's a dislike button and if you want to help the channel out completely for free please consider subscribing because it really really helps but without further ado let's dive in a quick game of the settlers. A quick game of the settlers. Start. Save room. <laughs> I love this game so much. Oh, it's al it already knows where I am. Uh, how do you choose the exit? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Play. <laughs> Made with unity. Go. Save room. Save room. Uh, level. Options. Menu. Yeah, Maybe menu? Menu. There we are. Level one. <laughs> oh, man. I love this game so much. I don't know why either. I think it's because I, I actually really enjoy inventory management. I think that's one of the key... That's one of the weird things about my brain that I actually really like inventory management. So all you've got to do is you've got your stash on the right-hand side, you've got your inventory on the left, and you're just going to make things fit in the highlighted spots. So all you got to do, finish. Wabam. Next loadout. Next game. And we've got healing items ripped directly from Resident Evil, I want to say 5. Because inventory is infamously bad always. Brilliant. 
Arv needs to play this. So like you gotta fit that there, fit that there, and fit that there. And then this person can go off and do what they need to do. And it gets better because you've got stuff like you've got to reload guns and you've got to make sure guns are loaded and you've got to make sure that your character's healed and stuff like that. So uh, let's just remove these out of the way. Do you know, do you want to know a fun fact? Last time I played this, I was playing it on, I was playing it through OBS. Um, so it was really slow and laggy for me. I was playing it offline for a uh, video and I just didn't, I can't believe how smooth this is now. <laughs> My setup has changed so radically in the last like few months. It's mental. So we're going to we need to put the shotgun here because there's no other spaces. That means there's an egg to go there. That means there's probably a grenade to go there. I'm going to say an egg there, but I'm not 100 certain. This SMP is going to be a real pain if we're not careful. But that gun can probably go there. That gun can go there. That grenade can go there. And that egg can go there. And bosh, we're done. Can you imagine a survival game where your inventory was this? I'd love it. I'd lo as long as it was paused, like when I was sorting the inventory out, I'd absolutely be fine with it. Uh, right, so shotgun. Let's go there. Rifle. Let's go there. No, 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 no pause. Uh, well, I mean, I wouldn't hate it. I wouldn't love it, but I wouldn't hate it. Uh, so I need enough space. Oh, sorry, I can go there and I can go here. Like you actually got to fit everything in your bags in a rush. I don't, well, this would be good training then, right? Wah, my egg. I also have a proclivity to turn the egg the right way around and I don't know why. <laughs> I just like having the egg the right way around. So this is a good example. So we've got... Um, um, uh, <laughs> try again. We've got uh, machine pistol ammo. That loads into that gun. And we've got handgun ammo. That loads into that gun. Which means these are now... These will now fit. There you go. They would have fit anyway. But it teaches you that you can reload these guns. So uh, machine pistol, handgun, and rifle. That's rifle? Yeah. Rough. Rough ammo. It's not smooth ammo. It's rough ammo. Or dog ammo, I suppose, depending on the sound your dog makes. Have you played Tarkov? Next level inventory management game. I've not. I have not played Tarkov. I have not played Tarkov at all. This does remind me a little bit. I don't know if it was like this, but you know, um, the Metro games? The Metro games feel like they would have been like this. Like, I'm, I'm not 100% certain. Also, these can stack as well. And then you get into the fun fun and glorious uh, realm of needing to split the ammo between different guns. Uh, there we go. Put you here. Put you here. And here. And here. And I've done something horribly, horribly wrong. Oh, I know, I've done that there. There we go. And that there, and that there. And it's only 40 levels. I mean, I, I'm guessing we're going to get it done within the next one hour. Considering we're already on level 9. But they, they do get super hard. <laughs> From actually having a decent day, I'm great. If not, every move is an integral arg internal argument over who is what. Oh no, is that like a, a nerve thing? Um, I have a friend who, who has um, uh, unexplainable nerve issues and they just can't they can't walk some days. It's really bizarre. Um, shotgun ammo, shotgun ammo, shotgun ammo. There we go. You don't get rockets for the rocket launcher. The rocket launcher is just there. So this is clearly a boss fight that this person's going into. Um, let's try and put you there. And let's try and put you all... You won't go anywhere, will you? You cheeky sneak. Let's put you there then. Let's put you there. Bosh, bosh, bosh. That's not going to work. That is, though. I don't know why I love inventory management so much. I just love it. It's one of the things I really like about games. I love inventory management. Uh, this is uh, machine pistol ammo. So we'll put that there. And now we have 100 of those, which is good. Handgun ammo and handgun ammo. I also will take everything out of this first, like a hundred percent. 
my egg the right way around my egg the right way around a grenade i mean that's always already the right way around so let's start with the rocket launcher let's do that let's start with the rifle let's do that machine pistol can go there pistol pistol can go probably here no that's not gonna work is it that'll work because then we can have ammo and ammo and oops and ammo and a grenade and pop that oh god there and then an eggy and then an eggy excellent excellent now we've got a fade spray as in a, a first aid spray um but we've also got a shotgun that needs reloading and a rifle that needs reloading as well oh, as if i have three bullets left for the rifle that's unfortunate uh shotgun mix those uh use this that healed me because i was damaged and now let's take the pump action shotgun and the rifle and then put that there 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 and then we have we even have an extra space fantastic we've got space for days we can even pick up an item machine pistol ammo handgun ammo magnum ammo more magnum ammo uh, I, I don't, can't remember if um, items, guns have to be fully loaded or not. Uh, also, eggs it will only heal you a little bit. So if I use one egg, that'll heal into yellow. I heal you another egg, that'll heal into green. So uh, red to green, green to yellow. Wait. Oh, it's my door. <laughs> I wondered. Oh, I haven't changed the stream information. Whoopsie, sorry. Save room. There we go. Hopefully, it's not done. Uh, save room. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> um, hopefully, it's not uh, screwed anything up. I kept hearing a creaking noise in the background, and I wasn't sure what it was. And I then realized it was actually a creaking noise in my house, which normally really upsets me when there's a weird creaky noise and I don't know what it is. But it was okay. It was just my door. Because it's actually... Is it really nice? Oh, again? No, it's not. That's not real rain. That's game rain. It's not life rain. It's game rain. Fish! Alright, so we've got some fish to play with as well. Let's reload stuff first. Let's reload the handgun. And let's reload the shotgun. Let's reload the magnum. And let's reload the rifle. That takes a lot of that out of the way. Now... The thing with a fish is I think, let me just examine it, small amount of health, the sardine. Again, ripped straight from Resident Evil 5. Um, so I'm going to use the sardines first. Use that, which will take me from red to yellow. Use this one, which will take me from yellow to green. That is because the sardines will take up more room, which means I want to try and just maximize the amount of uh, small items I have. Oh, that only fits there. Curses. Oh, no, it doesn't only fit there. Oh, no, that's the wrong space. I've done a blunder. There we go. Oh, no, don't. Take the shotgun, not the fish. So that goes there and that goes there. That can go here. That won't fit anywhere. Okay, cool. So let's move this out of the way. Let's move that there. Uh, let's move that there. That's also not going to work, is it? <laughs> you love the assault firearms, zero ammo, and a fish. Well, boy, it's got a heal. Uh, can't use this. No, cool, 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 cool. cool. Uh, let's. Oh, I know. Uh, the only, the only bad thing I, I don't like about this is I have to make sure. Oh, it's, is that not what I wanted? Uh, no, that's not what I wanted. Okay, the only bad thing is when I put something down in the stash, it doesn't pick up what I'm placing in front of it, if that makes sense. Oh, I can't put that there. Mm, that's unfortunate. Uh, let's do this then. Boop. 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 That's never going to work. <laughs> never in a month of Sundays. Is that going to work? Uh, right, that definitely doesn't fit there. Definitely doesn't fit there. Does fit there though. Okay. This. I need to put that there so that gives me the most amount of room here. 
I need to put that here. Oh no, that's so unfortunate. Um, now what if I use that there? And I put that there. I still don't have room for the fish. What's going on with the fish? Um, yeah, I don't have room for that fish. What's going on with that fish? Uh, what if? Bear with me. Heard my zoogram idea. Walk into a party. Bear with me. Uh, no, that's not there. That's not going to work. I don't think that's going to work. Uh, no, don't combine. I appear to have forgotten how to play this game. It must work like this. There must be something I can do here. Let's put the fish in first. Right? Because then, if I go that, I then I have no room for this. So then, wait, menu. Level 13. What have I done wrong? Okay, let's take these out. Fish bash bosh. Fish, nope. Can I combine? No, can't. No, can we? Fish, fish, fish. Egg, egg. Uh, no, no, stop it. Uh, shotgun, and handgun, and magnum, and rifle. Okay, so rifle definitely can't go there. But could go... Can't go there. Oh, it could go there. Yes, it could go there. Oh, yeah, that's interesting. But that does leave me no, next to no room there. So that's unfortunate. Um, but that could go there. That could go there. This leaves me nothing here. Curse yes, yes. Curse the world. Um, it's almost like I need to slot this in here, but I can't. So if I slot that in there, and I slot that in there. I have one, two, three, four, five. And I can use two of these. So I am going to have to find space. I can't remember how to do this one. That's unfortunate. It's real embarrassing, that's what it is. Because um, that could go there, but then I don't know how I would make the the guns fit. Oh, I feel like I nearly had it then. Uh, not quite. Not quite. This is 100% doable. I can, I can almost see it. So if we get rid of those first. Um, oh, I've, I've screwed that up. There we go. Because I can move this to like... I uh, know I can't. Sorry. I can move this to like here. And then could that go... No. Yes. No, it wouldn't. No, it absolutely wouldn't. If I put that there, that wouldn't fit anywhere here, would it? No, that wouldn't. There would be no room for it. No godly room. And if I put it there, then it's well in the way. But if I put it there, then it could be like that. But there would be no... This one would be like the ultimate nightmare of inventory in real time. Yeah, this is, this is the real time killer. This is the run killer, 100%. Um, it's the handgun I'm having issues with. And I just, I don't see why I can't just flip this around horizontally. <laughs> that's what, that's the problem. There needs to be some... New on Switch, Power Wash Simulator, Bikini Bottom DLC. There's a tower to stream. <laughs> so that must go here. But then I do not understand how that fits there anymore. I've completely forgotten how to play this game, apparently. I was like, yeah, I know how to play this game. I've I've, I've played a bit of this before. Uh, and if that goes there, then that goes... No, because there's no space for it. 
eat some fish. I can eat some fish, but I'm going to eat two. Because that takes me from red to yellow, and that takes me from yellow to green. And then, like, having the eggs in there is fine. And then what if I have this space here? But then I don't have that space, which is sad. That makes my... That makes my brain sad. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, there's enough spaces. I don't want to cram some fish in my face hole and go. <laughs> just, there are a couple of these where I'm just like, I just, if I were playing this game, I'd abandon this item. Like, <laughs> just go without. It must be the orientation of this. Where else can this go in comparison? I don't think this can go anywhere else. Can I go there and that go... No, see, that can't go anywhere here. So, that's a, a silly idea. Unless this goes here. And again, I wouldn't go there, would it? Because there's now no room whatsoever for the guns. This would go... Yeah, this would have to go there. So what if I went there, and then that went there... And then I went there, and he's gone and done it. How I've done it, I'm not sure, but we've done it. Level 13 done. Fantastic. Uh, now I know why Swan of Shotguns exist. Yeah. <laughs> no, don't combine the rocket launcher and the fish. That never ends well. Trust me. Uh, right. I'm going to Marie Kondo this. I'm going to take everything out, and then I'm going to... Why have you got two rocket launchers? You greedy sod. Stop hoarding rocket launchers. Uh, right, I'm going to eat that fish. Excellent. Uh, I'm going to... I can't stop that fish. Balls. Boop, 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 boop. And put these there. Do I then have fish space? I've then got fish space. <laughs> There's a sentence I didn't think I'd say today. And then egg, and then egg, right next to the fish, just so they can all marinate together. Yeah, <laughs> to fit short sort of shotguns <laughs> under trench coats and other weird inventory slots. Uh, right, so now I've got next to no health. Eat one of those, and then eat one of those, and then we've got a lovely amount of space left. One, two, three. And we can make the holy symbol of the egg fish to uh, summon our Lord and Saviour, uh, Jesus Christ. There you go. Uh, right, Magnum Ammo. No, yeah, Magnum Ammo, good. Um, machine Pistol's fine. Ah, herbs, great. So I'm going to combine this to that. I'm going to ingest that, and that's going to heal me. I'm going to move these out of the way. And then we're going to start with the biggest item, because it's bulky AF. And, and that, and then that. And then all of those spaces should be joined, apart from some of the egg spaces. Which I think we've done it. Yeah. Oh, my eggs are the wrong way around. There we go. That dude is what you call in a survival game a loot pinata. No weapons, armor, zip. Just food. It's like big, big game hunting, but more variety. <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm going to combine the green herb and the red herb. I'm going to ingest that so that's what it heals me. This, there's no room for, so I need to just combine these. Reload the handgun. Reload the shotgun. Oops. There we go. And then I've got room for the rocket launcher. But that that being said, the rocket launcher is definitely going to go in that space. I can feel it. That's going to go there. That's going to go there. That's going to go there. That's... Oh, poo. I've done the wrong thing. There we go. Level 17. Good, good. Uh, right, so I'm still injured. So combine red, yellow, and green. Um, now that's going to heal me more than I need. But it's going to get rid of an extra item as well. Uh, combine those, combine those, combine those, uh, put that in the shotgun, put those in the shotgun, put those in the handgun, and put those in the machine pistol, lovely. So now, if I go for this one, well there's no eggs, so I'm going to have to do that, I think, and then that, 
And then I've not got space for the handgun, which is unfortunate. Could I maybe have an extra space if I did that? Oh, there's actually no space for the handgun. Got it. Uh, let's move that down there. Let's move this. Ah, let's... I, did, I, I forgot my cardinal rule there. I didn't take the rocket launcher out of the stash, out of the inventory. I left it in there and started working around it. It was a big no-no for me. Right. Now, pop that down here. Now, where are you going to go? You adorable little darling. And then you're going to go... I need a bigger space than that for that handgun. You're not going to go there, are you? You're going to go somewhere completely different. Ah, you're going to go there. You're going to go there. You're going to go there. And then we've got one. Oh, nearly. So close. Uh, you're going to turn yourself around. And then... Oh, I'm still not going to have space. Curses. Curses. Um, um, oh wait, if I do, no, I've still got space. Oh no, I do have space. Hooray. One, two, three. There we are. Level 18 done. Oh, that was me touching my joypad. I uh, didn't realize that worked on controller. Um, that was just a, an impulse thing, that. I, I'm gonna mix these. Yeah. I'm going to reload the rifle first, and then I'm going to reload the machine pistol. Then the handgun. I've got a little bit of handgun ammo left. And then the shotgun. Cool. A little bit of shotgun ammo left. I'm going to eat the herbs, so I freeze that up, and I'm going to try my best to take all of the items out of the inventory. There we go. Okay. I hate that it puts uh, red in the middle of the herb mix. <laughs> yep. I'd rather it just be a mixed colour, to be honest with you. Um, so if I put that there, and then I can put that there, and then I can put that there, that's a, that's a good. The rifle is going to prove to be a bit tricky, but that puts that in a good spot. That probably puts... No, that's a lousy spot for that, isn't it? That's unfortunate. What about that? And then, no, there's no space for that anymore. But if I do that, and then... Oh, that does not fit anywhere here, does it? Oh, no, it fits like that. It's just now the shotgun doesn't fit. Oh, no, it does. It does fit. I'm just being silly. Nope. Oh, egg the right way around. We're halfway there, people. We're halfway there. Now, machine pistol, handgun, shotgun. Put that in the shotgun. Ugh. Put that in the machine pistol. And put that in the handgun. Lovely. Now, I want to try and use all of these items. So I'm going to combine this and this. And then I'm going to use this. Good. That doesn't heal me fully. But I'm also going to use this, which will heal me fully. Meaning I've also got one less item in my inventory. Which is a good thing. It's a good thing. That's a perfect slot for that. And then we've got Bibbidi, Bobbidi, and Boo. There we are. Now, we have sardines and rotten sardines. Now, one of the things about this is a rotten sardine not edible in the slightest. It is, though, because if I use it, I inflict damage on myself. Which, you know, you might think to yourself, I don't really want to do that. But in this instance, you do want to do that. Because now what you can do is you can use another sardine to heal yourself. And then it's a Burberry fish. I never thought about it like that, but you're absolutely right. It is. It's a chav fish. Um, and uh, yeah, so now I've got two less items in my inventory in order to put in. And oh, that's, that's a desert. Eagle. That's the killer six. That's what that is. So now, if I pop that in there, and I pop that in there, I'm going to do this, and this, and this, and this, and then turn my egg the right way around. 
And then that's level 21 done. Okay, so let's think about this real quick. Let's do some magnum rounds. Let's do some handgun bullets. Oh, that's a shotgun. Oh, more magnum rounds. I forgot I had another magnum. And shotgun rounds will go into here. Now we've also got rotten eggs as well. Examine. Rotten eggs is completely rotten. It's turned green. It's not edible at all. That's what you think. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to eat both of these. Because that will not kill me. But that will take me to very low health. And then I'm going to combine all three of these herbs. <laughs> it's not how physics works. And then I'm going to eat that. And then that will fill me to full. So that's all my Healy, Healy Bob's done. Uh, take the shotgun. I think it's probably going to go best there because of the shape of some of the other stuff. Um, that's probably going to go there. Uh, oh, maybe not. Uh, well, mm, uh, mm, well mm, no <laughs> is, is the word is no is the word I'm looking for. Wrong is the word I'm looking for there. Uh, let's pop you there. Pop you there. Spin you right round, baby, right round. Um, and then go there, and then uh, there, and then. Oops. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh, uh, I see. I see what I've done here. Is I've I've done a mishap. Here is I've uh, done a wrong. Because I don't have the the spaces in order to do what I need to do. That's unfortunate. I'm close, but I, I'm not quite there. Uh, what if I turn? That doesn't fit anywhere else, does it? Not not here, anyway. And I, I definitely need to take the gun with me. <laughs> Where do I turn this around? That's not going to work. That's the closest I got, though. If I put that now back here, and then I'm like... Here and here. And then that's... That's exactly the same problem I had a second ago. <laughs> That's the identical problem. Oh, wait. If I do that... No, it's still a problem. No, I don't want to combine the gun. I can't combine guns with guns. I'm not Neo from The Matrix. The hit movie The Matrix. Uh, okay. here and here let's try one two three. i don't i don't think that's gonna work though that's the thing no there's no spacey bobs for it unfortunate what about there like i don't know if that's gonna work that has to go in a position similar to that it has to but in order to do that there's no there's no additional... Oh, wait. No. What if it's there? Oh, what if it's there and there? Will that work? No. No one will go there. God. Dang it. So close. So close. So what if I make this that way? And then put... This is the wrong way around though now, isn't it? That's, I think I need this. This way. Oh no, that's not the wrong way around. That, that was the correct orientation. But the wrong... Uh... Okay, now I'm confused myself. I need to stop. <laughs> Pop you there, pop you there, pop you there. It's not gonna work. Could we not just like pour the bullets into our f into our hand or something? <laughs> Is that not a thing we can do? Can we not keep the bullets loose in our pocket? Uh, you're not gonna go there. No, so one, two, three, four, five. That's not gonna work. So it needs to be either this way or this way in that orientation. I think it might be the magnum that's the problem. Let's put you there. Let's put you there. Let's put you there. Let's put you 
That's so close to working. Oh, wait. One, two, one. Uh, oh, wait. There. I've done it. Yes. Fantastic. I was so concerned with getting the guns all together, I didn't realize I could have space between the guns. Uh, now, we have two different shotguns now, which is different. Uh, <laughs> that's, which is obvious, because that's what I've just said. Um, we have one that takes 12, and one that takes 7. Okay. So sometimes you'll have ones that take different amounts of bullets, but you have to make sure each gun has bullets in it. So, you need to make sure that everything, everything syncs up well. Now, we've got the same problem that we had earlier. I want to use... I want to use that egg, and then I want to heal myself, and then I want to use that egg, and then I want to heal myself, leaving me a single egg, which is good, I think. Yeah, because I can't injure myself two levels. Oh, and magnum bullets, cool. So, take that out, because I forget to do that, and then I screw myself over. Put that there. The egg must go there, then. Which means a magnum goes there, and which means a magnum goes there. You see, they have these levels that are, like, mega easy. And then they'll just intersperse it with a really hard one. Uh, thingy blammo. There we go. Magnum ammo. Uh, handgun ammo. Now we've got herbs and a first aid spray, which is real awkward. And machine pistol ammo. So, oh, I don't have space in the in the stash in order to take this gun out. There we go. So let's think about the health items first. That heals me fully. That heals me one. That injures me one level, and that will heal me fully. So if I combine this, 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 and this, then I injure myself, and I heal myself. Then I injure myself. Then I heal myself. Then we're sorted. And we have no more reason to have any um, thingy. Uh, what's the word? Healy items. That's the word. And that won't fit there. But it might fit. Well, it doesn't really fit there, does it? I'll be honest. If it's there, though, that's a good spot for it. And if I have that there. And that might allow me to have that there, which will allow me to have nothing else anywhere. Sad times. Um, yeah, I think it's this, it's this pistol that's the problem. Whoops. So if that's there, could that be somewhere else? No, that's... Oof, that's not going to work in the slightest. That might work. And then one, two, three. Oh, but... That's the wrong shape. Curses. Um. Ow. Nodules. Um. What if we take these out and then we rotatify these to there and there, and then that has space, but then we don't have enough space for this which is also sad curses um and then what if that is there then and then that is one two that that feels very close that feels like i'm on the right path there one two nearly there and there there we go we're figuring it out. And then we have space for the ammo. We're fully healed. All the guns are loaded. Ooh, we have a sniper rifle. Uh, and we have lots of other stuff as well. So magnum ammo, good. Rifle ammo, rifle ammo, spares. Handgun ammo, oops. Spares, and then, oh. And then machine pistol ammo, excellent. Uh, now, do exactly the same as last time. Injure myself, heal myself, injure myself, heal myself. Cool. I'll leave me an egg and some bullets. I'm going to 
stack on this side because this gun's massive. Right. Okay. So we've got this. This has to go in first. The car, it can't not go in first. It can go in the top or the bottom. Is there any difference between the top and the bottom? I don't think there is. I don't think it would put it in the right place first try, though. I just don't get that vibe from this game. Let me put you... Ooh. If I put that there, then I can put that there and then that there. Now, is there any space? Whoopsie. For this, there is, but then there's no space for one, two, no, no. Ah, there. Got it. One, two. I might take a little while to get there, but I get there in the end. <laughs> I'll make it on my own. Right, so now we're introducing gunpowder, which you combine to make bullets. So if I combine that and that, the red ones, and then and I combine the blue ones, then I can make SMG ammo, or rather I can make... Uh, handgun ammo and SMG ammo, respectively. <laughs> I just literally placed the SMG there just to make sure I knew where the pistol was going. So the thing being, we now have, if I examine this, this gunpowder is used as a component for shotgun and rifle ammo. And the blue one makes machine pistol and rifle ammo. And the red one makes handgun and magnum ammo. So you kind of have to experiment here because I need magnum ammo. So I'm going to assume it's blue and red. And I can't mix them. <laughs> Combine. There we go. No. Is it... Combine blue and green? Yes. Magnum ammo. Good. Wait. that is that a magnum? No, that's a handgun. I've just made magnum ammo for no reason. Let me restart. <laughs> so I need handgun, SMG, and shotgun ammo. Which is just basically the three... They, the three colors combined. Got it. Handgun. SMG. I'm making this more complicated than it needs to be. And then we have a couple of spare shotgun shells. So if we put that there, and then we obviously turn that egg the right way around. We can pop that there, pop that there, pop this hopefully in here. Yep. There we go. Lovely. Oh, egg the right way around. Okay. What level are we on? 28. Lovely stuff. So we now need. Uh, rifle ammo and shotgun ammo. So if I combine this and this, we get rifle ammo. And if I combine this and this, we get shotgun ammo, which is lovely. And then we have a spare gunpowder, which we do have to take, unfortunately. That's just part of it. But this I'm probably going to put... Oh, I can't put that there. I'm going to turn that around, though, because that can go there and that can go there. Make sure the eggs are in the correct orientation. It's very important. It's not important in the slightest, but it's important to my brain. There we go. I'll mix rotten food and fresh food with, like, gunpowder and stuff. But, yeah, God God forbid I uh, don't have my eggs the right way around. Um, so now we've got shotgun, machine pistol, and handgun powder. But I need magnum ammo. I need handgun ammo. And I need SMG ammo, which I've now got. And I've got a spare powder as well. So, I'm not going to lie, when I played this offline, it was, I was a little worried that the music would be a bit annoying. Now, you let me know, please let me know if the music is very annoying, and I can absolutely turn it off. I mean, we are at the later stages of the game, but I was very aware at this point, probably, that the music was, uh, was a bit much. Uh, it was very repetitive, I must admit, but fortunately... You've got my wonderful dulcet tones talking over the top of it, so hopefully that helps. Um, that's handgun ammo. It's not. It's magnum ammo. <laughs> it's not what I need. I got that. And then if I combine blue and blue, I'll get SMG ammo. And then I've got all of the grenades in the world. There we go. So now I take this honking great sniper rifle. Cram a grenade there. Cram a grenade there. This absolute unit of a shotgun. And then... Oh, I hate this SMG. This SMG is such a weird shape. It really is. And then the problem is I've got that. If I take that away... Oopsie. I can pop that there. But then there's no space for the magnum. Which is unfortunate. So that goes back in there. What if that goes there? 
That's the dumbest idea I've ever had in my life. And I've had some I've had some real corkers. Um Puma there. Where's popular corner? Oh, I'm about to get abducted by a biker gang. Um there's a weird biker sound outside. If I pop you there and I pop you there, then I'm just playing tidy up with the rest of the bits. Which means, oh, I'm, I'm one space short. How can I make that one space happen? Ooh, how can I make that one space? I can't make that one space happen. No, there's no way of making that space happen. Curses. Um... Ah, oh, damn it. Right, okay. Take everything back out. Oops. No, I don't wish to combine my gun with anything else. Thank you. No, once again. This is my tired hand. Leaning on my mouse button. <laughs> right. Let's put that there. And then let's put that... See, well, that, that sort of works. <laughs> that motorbike outside, oh my dear. Um, I say motorbike, I'm using the term motorbike very loosely there. That's definitely like a dirt bike or something. But put that there. So I have got a big, big long space here, which is unfortunate. I've got a space of three there. Which won't fit anything, will it? Really? Let's put all the little bits in and around here. Let's pop that. Oh, oh yeah, that, that good. That works. Um, let's pop this upside down here. Because let's pop this in this corner. What happens? How can I how can I make these fit better? Is it like that maybe? Then maybe there's a space for the weird SMG. And there's a space for the Magnum, but there's no space for the pistol, which is unfortunate. Um, I'm, in, I'm in the way. I'm in the way there. What if I do that? Yeah, if I do that, and then I'll go here. But then it's this SMG that's in the way, isn't it? Sort of. It's sort of in the way. It's a good spot for it, though. Especially as... Let's pop it out a second. No, no, no. No, no. Go around. There we go. Um, if I turn that... Oh, interesting. It won't fit that way anymore. Cool. So what if you fit that way? Yeah. Oh, so close. So close. So very, very close. Um let's put this here. <laughs> Absolutely questionable results. There should be an option to go full Ripley when the level gets too annoying. Bring on the gaffer tape. I think you, we could definitely tie... We could definitely strap a couple of grenades to this rifle. I'm not going to lie. Or a couple of grenades to the end of the shotgun. Um, speaking of which, actually. What if I just put that there and that there? And then if I turn that around. And then... No, because I've not got any space there. Have I? That's unfortunate. But I feel like we were sort of... Oh, we're getting there. Oh. Oh, no. So close. What if it's there instead? Then I've got two space there. No. No. Then I've got two space there and three one spaces, which isn't very good. Oh, this is infuriatingly close. Um, oops. What if I do this? Two, two, two. Oh no, that won't work either. Curse is so nearly. 
Um, Magnum bottom left. Magnum bottom left. Well, like here, do you mean? So if I use that as the premise there, that'll go there. But then where am I putting the SMG now? The SMG is a funny shape. That's the problem with it. Let's take these grenades out and the egg. Oh, swap the two smaller guns around as it was before. Sorry, the two smaller guns. Uh, oh, so you mean this? You mean uh, Magnum bottom left and then this here. So now if I put that there... I still don't have room for the thing though, the SMG, which is weird. How can I make room for SMG? Can that make room for SMG? No. Can... How do I make room for SMG? This is really annoying. This is really in the way. And there's no other way of having it that is not in the way. This is a very annoying gun. Oh, and it's, it is annoying that I can... Oh, God, no, don't goodbye. Um, I can't lift and shift. So if I have that allow... I might be going around in circles now. I think I'm going mental. I think I'm going around in circles. Um, yeah, because I'll be out of space, won't I? If I have that there. Two space, two space, two space, and three one spaces. Two space, two space, two space, and three one spaces. I need a two space and one space. Kisses. This is the closest we've got, though. So let's build on this. So what can change here? Um, probably not that. Two space, two space, two space, and three one spaces. That's exactly the same. But it can move, so there is that. What if I have that that way? I just move this out of the way. Whoops. Move this other way, and then go to here, and then go to here. No, go here, go here, go here, go here. And now that's also not correct. <laughs> that is though. Um, and then that fills up that space. That fills up that space. That fills up that two space. That fills up that two space. Thank God. There we go. Like I said, every now and then the difficulty curve just seems to spike really hard in this. And weirdly, I do find it a really relaxing game. Because I do love this sort of stuff. I love inventory management. Ah, now I've got two things that will heal me. One thing that will heal me quite a lot. One thing that will heal me a little bit. That's just a little Healy Bob. And I used to use the big Healy Bob. So now I need shotgun ammo, which I've got here. I need handgun ammo, which I've got here. And I need SMG ammo, which I now have here. So now that's only going to fit that way. That's probably only gonna fit one way let's say there and then let's put the handgun oh no i've screwed that up now let's put that there and then let's put that oh that's oh so this is where the tricky bit comes in <laughs> i see because <laughs> i have three grenades that i need to get in as well uh one two Buckle my shoe. Nope. One. Oh no, I've not put myself any space there. That's unfortunate. Uh, one, two. Nope. One, two. Nope. One, two, three. There we go. <laughs> it would help. Oh, 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 I don't like that. No, pick that up. Oh, I don't, I don't want to combine it. There we go. I didn't like that that was the wrong way around. I don't know why. I, c I cannot explain that. I cannot explain why I didn't like that was the wrong way around then. 
Uh, okay, so we've got Healy Duffers. Combine that and that. If I heal that, what happens? Okay, so I can't heal any of that. So combine that with that as well. Partially heal myself, and then fully heal myself, which means I only have an egg to worry about. A little egg. I need Magnum, Shotgun, Rifle, and SMG. Shotgun. Ka-ching. Uh, hmm. Combine. Oh, no, thank you. Combine. Uh, Magnum. Good. And SMG. I've done something wrong here because all guns need to be uh, loaded. So restart that. All guns should be loaded. Oh, thank you, question. Um, so I don't need handgun ammo. I do need rifle ammo, which I think is this one and this one. Yeah, cool. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, there's a shotgun. Need to stop using the wrong keyboard. <laughs> it's a shotgun. Right, this is where it gets a little bit confusing. I have enough gunpowder to make one lot of 10 shotgun rounds, but I have one shotgun that takes 12 rounds, 12 cartridges, and I have another shotgun that takes seven cartridges. So if I put the 10 cartridges into the 12 capacity shotgun, I use all my cartridges and I can't finish the level. If I use my 10 cartridge, uh, 10 cartridge packet on the seven cartridge capacity shotgun, I have three left over, which means I then put three into the 12 capacity shotgun, meaning all shotguns have ammunition in them. It's a bit sneaky, but all shotguns have ammunition in them. Uh, yeah, combine. So heal myself a little bit and then heal myself a lot, a little lot. There we go. Uh, SMG, cool. And then, yes, Magnum ammo. So Magnum ammo, a couple of spares and SMG. All guns have bullets in them, brilliant. So now put you there, move you out of the way because you're well in the way, mate. Oh, there's a part of me that doesn't know if that's right. Um, I guess I'll find out soon enough. Uh, right, it's the, the SMG. Yeah, you're not there, are you? You need to be. Let's put you there and let's not put you there because you don't fit. Where, where else do you fit, friend? You fit there, of course you do. You fit there, and you fit there. Cool. There are some times in this game where I overcomplicate it, and I'm, I don't like that I overcomplicate it. So let's do some healies. I'm, I'm gonna have to use both of these, aren't I? Let's be honest, use that, then use that. I've got nothing to damage myself with, which means I have four eggs to look after. Oh boy. So let's make some handgun ammo for this gun. I've got a magnum and an SMG. Let's make some magnum ammo. It leaves me two left over. And let's make some SMG ammo. Now, to cut down on the amount of boxes I'm gonna have to carry, I'm gonna make, do those two make magnum ammo? I can't remember. No, they don't. Okay, so I'm gonna just combine these two. I'm gonna put that in the SMG and I'm gonna have one floating. Um, uh, red gunpowder. Now, if I just pop that there and that there, <laughs> let's let's just roll with how it's laid it out, shall we? And then I just pop that there and that there. Now, if I go, oh, that's probably not going to work. That's also probably not going to work, which is a shame because it felt like it was gonna. Uh, what if the pistol goes there though? That takes up a full space. Now the problem being. I now don't have a space for that, which is a shame, because that would have worked otherwise, but this will probably fit here, these will probably fit here, let's put you here and you here, um, mm, that's not a thing that's going to work, let's move, I think I'm going to have to move the rocket launcher, just one space, just one little teeny weeny space, I don't think it fits any other way, I mean upside down yes, but I don't really want to put it upside down. Um, let's put you there. <laughs> um, now I'm kind of out of space for the pistol, which is unfortunate. 
Oh, no, I'm not. There we go. And then the A2 space, and I just fill the rest of my inventory up with delicious breakable eggs. There we go. Level 34 done. We are seven away from the end. So let's combine these herbs and these herbs. And let's, yeah, I guess using these is fine. Now I've got to make sure I use the one with the green and yellow first and not the green and red, because the green and red will heal me fully, which will screw it up, basically. Um, so I need shotgun ammo. I need some handgun ammo. Oops. And I need some magnum ammo. Same deal with this. One has a higher cast than the other. This can t take 10 bullets. This can take six bullets. Oh, sorry, eight bullets? Is that? Eight bullets. So put the magnum ammo in the eight bullets first, then put the remainder in the two. So then I've got everything loaded, basically. Um, I'm going to put this sideways because I hate myself. Um, and then I'm going to put that there, that there, this here, this here, and then fill the rest with correctly orientated eggs. Thank goodness. Thank goodness for correctly orientated eggs, eh? Uh, okay, 35. So now I'm going to have to... I can hear myself a little bit. I don't know if I can just combine these. Does that do anything? No, it doesn't. Right, so I'm going to combine that. Right, I need to restart because I've done that wrong. <laughs> I've done it wrong already. So green and yellow and green and red and then red and yellow. So that's a useless herb, right? Use that one first, then use that one. But that's the spare. That's the carryover. Uh, rocket launcher. I feel like it's going to go... Yeah, probably there, to be honest with you. Uh, combine this to make some magnum ammo. Again, share the eight first, then the two. Combine this for some rifle ammo, I want to say. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Had to double check that was a rifle before I did that. And then put that handgun ammo in there. So the rifle can go there. The... Oh. The... The pistol can go there, I suppose, which means I have a two space and a two space, which means I have this and I, oh shit, I have this as well. Okay, so we have, there's a lot, there's a lot to unpack here. I'm going to use the Burberry fish and then I'm going to use the normal fish. That saves up a lot of inventory space. I'm going to make some shotgun shells and I'm going to put them in the auto shotgun. I'm going to make some handgun bullets. I'm going to pop them in the handgun. I'm going to make some magnum bullets. Oops. And I'm going to split them between the eight and the two. And then I'm going to make some rifle bullets. And I'm going to stick it in the rifle. Good. Which leaves us only a little bit of handgun over there. Take all these grenades out. Now, what's the biggest thing we've got here? The biggest thing we've got here is a rifle, which will only fit in this, in this space. Uh, should you have eaten an egg before a good fish? Ooh, I think the bad fish only takes me down from green to yellow, and the good fish only takes me from yellow to green, but the eggs also do the same. I think, unless the bad fish takes me from green to red and I just completely missed it. Um, but you, you could be right there. That looks like a good space for that. That looks like a good space for that. Oops, that looks like a good space for that. That looks like a good space for that. Put that there. Put that there. Put that there. And then, oh no, that egg's the wrong way around. Curses. And then just, I do, it's, it's probably safe just to hook both these grenades by the pin, right? I mean, that's how you store grenades. I'm pretty sure that's how you store grenades. Just store them like, um, like, like that sort of thing. Just hook them together. That'll be fine. Uh, so, green health. So we've got good, medium, bad. This is going to take us down to medium. Then that's going to get healed. And then that's going to take us down to medium again. And then that's going to get healed. And then we've just got one. One little orphaned egg to look after. We need some handgun bullets. And we need some... Oh, no, not rifle bullets. Curses. That was a total misclick. And heal and damage and heal taking the damage boost we need smg ammo 
for the incredibly awkward SMG. I remember this level being very difficult. If it takes me longer than a couple of minutes to do this, I'm going to skip this level just to make people aware. Because we've got three levels left. I've got five minutes left on stream. Um, so I don't want to be stuck here, basically. Which I think makes total sense. Um, but there is a chance I'll just nail it first try. It's unlikely. But there's a chance. Um, nope. No, maybe, maybe, baby. Let me do the magnum first. Let me do my magnum opus. <gasps> has he done it? Is he? Has he made the holy, the holy? No, he hasn't. Curses. <laughs> oh, I got too cocky there. Uh, but however, if I stop trying to combine things, stop it. If I spin that round. Right round, baby, right round. Then I can do that. There we go. Finish the level. Cool. 38. Ah, ah, ah. Damage. Cool. Then heal. Cool. Then combine these. Even cooler. So now we need some shotgun ammo. And pop those in there. And we need some handgun ammo. So we're going to pop those in there. And we need some magnum ammo as well. So we get these two. Oh, it's rifle ammo. Sorry, that's my bad. Um, and then we need... Oh. Oh, no. Oh, I did it wrong. I always forget which one does what. Let's do the ammo first. Pop that in there. Pop that in there. There we go. I only have one magnum, which is good. I need some SMG ammo. And I need some rifle ammo. Excellent stuff. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, I've got the SMG ammo, which is here. And then I've got this, which is my shotgun ammo. Uh, lovely. And the remainders of all the ammo. Cool. Let's fix our healing situation. Let's damage and heal. Lovely. Take all these eggs out. Obviously. Oops. Correctly oriented. There we go. Uh, now, which is the bigger one? The rifle. Let's go with the rifle here. Um, oh, that's not going to make any sense there, is it? That's, oops. that's not going to help. Uh, curses. I was kind of hoping they'd sit really nicely together, but they're not going to. That's going to sit there. Uh, you're going to have to go there. You're going to have to go there. And you're going to have to go there. You're all going to have to play nice. Okay, I've had quite enough on this road trip. Um... <laughs> That's there, and that's there. So that's all of the big stuff stored. The problem being now, um, there's not enough space, which is unfortunate, but not unexpected. Uh, wait. Mm -mm, no, that's not. I don't think that's going to work like that. Well, that might work like that. That goes there. And then remove the eggs. Remove the eggs. Thank you. Thank you, Bruce. Jeez. <laughs> Cheers, Bruce. I appreciate you. That was UI blindness in action, that was. Mm -hmm. We're at the penultimate level. So let's saw the ammo out because I'm terrible at it. Uh, we need some shotgun shells. Uh, put in that first, then that. Good. We need some magnum ammo, which I think is these two. No, that's rifle ammo. I'm really bad at that. I don't know why I'm so bad at that. Uh, we need some... That's the wrong one. That's the wrong one. Some shotgun ammo. Did I just do this again? No, good. Rifle ammo. And some SMG ammo. And some more SMG ammo. Good. Combine those, pop it in that. Magnum, do the six, the eight, then the two. And then the shotgun, do the seven and the three. Health-wise, we are fully healed, but we have two ways of damaging ourselves. And we have a big old boatload of things that we can heal ourselves with. Um, I'm going to combine that with that. Oh, I can't. No, oh, that's unfortunate. Um, Okie dokie. In that case, those are just going to be spares, aren't they? Because if I damage myself... Uh, no, they're not. Actually, combine... 
there and combine there. I'm losing my marbles. Then fully heal myself. Then damage myself. Then fully heal myself. Good, good. So now if I take these out. Oh wait, combine these. Excellent. Now if I stick this... Oh my god, it's going to go nowhere. It's going to go absolutely nowhere. Um, the shotgun will go here. The rifle... Uh, the other shotgun, sorry, will go here. An eggy will go there. What about there? That doesn't feel like a good place to put that. Ooh, there's lots of space and not a lot of space. <laughs> Alright, pop that there. Pop that there. It's unfortunate that I can't go down there. It feels like it would be, it should be able to go down there. Where's the SMG? The SMG is a real awkward one, so I kind of want to get that in first. And also these, actually, now I'm thinking about it. These... Um, probably should be the other way around. Ooh, let's follow that. Uh, follow that. Because... I might be able to do that, then that, then that. So which will pop that there. And then there might just be space. No, curses, I've miscalculated. My my brain maths was off. No. Uh, well, okay, what if I put that there? And then... Oh, that doesn't work. Mm. How do we make space here? How do we make space? I'm missing... It is just that space there, isn't it? So that definitely doesn't fit there. That does, though. But that needs to move first. So if that goes there, then this can go here. Which might mean there will be more room down here. For, oops. No, don't combine. Stop trying to combine stuff all the time, you weirdo. Then that goes there, then that goes there. Then we have a two, a two, a two, a two, and two ones. Ooh, nearly. Nearly didn't orientate the eggs properly. Excellent. Okay, final level. That's a lot of stuff. Let's not be around the bush here. That's a lot of things. <laughs> okay, let's do the health stuff first. Actually, no, let's do ammo first because I'm rubbish at it. Uh, shotgun shells and I have one shotgun which is great. I have no SMG which is a bonus. I do have a handgun though so let's just make some handgun ammo real quick. Oh I do have an SMG. Curses. Down here it was hidden from me. And then I need a magnum ammo which I think is these. No that's rifle ammo you fool. Oh, I have a rifle too that's fine. Um, and then magnum ammo. Yes, which leaves me with one um, jar of blue gunpowder, which is fine. Now, health-wise, I'm going to combine and combine these, make myself a full complement of Healy Bobs. Oh, they look so delicious. And now I'm going to injure myself, heal myself, injure myself heal myself. So these are the remainders. Good. Nice. All present and correct. Now, there's too much stuff to take out of the thing, which makes me real sad. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to try my best, but I'm going to have to just play with, with one thing in there to begin with. I don't really want it to be that. I think that needs to go like this, and I think that needs to go like that, and I think <laughs> that needs to go there. There's a lot of half remembering things here. Um, no, that's probably not going to work there because I don't have space for that, which is which makes me sad. Um, what if it's there? And what if 
that's uh, it's not quite right. I'm going to be trying to just take up as much space as possible. I am not thinking about what's happening in the next couple of moves. Um, that's not right. Well, obviously it's not right. Well, I mean, there, there doesn't feel like there's space for it. So I'm just going to try and turn some stuff around. So if I take the rocket launcher out, and can I take the shotgun out? No, there's no room for it. But it, oops, if I move the SMG down, then I can take the shotgun out, then I can move this around. So move that here, and then move that here, and then that can go here, or even better, that can go there. Um, that can probably go there, that can probably go there, but then I have the problem of the SMG. I have the old SMG problem, which is a real issue. Uh, but if that goes there and that goes there, I don't have that problem anymore. Fantastic. But I now have the problem that I don't have enough spare space for things. Ah, which is a real, real sort of kick in the shins. Um... One, two, three, one, two, three. So I need... Wait. There. And then there? No. Oh, that was... That felt like I was going to get that done then. Uh, one, two, three. I'm still... Behind a smidge. And what if that comes out and that goes there? That comes this way, that goes that way, and that goes that way. Yeah, it's not really going to help much, is it? Let's be honest. It's not really going to do a lot. Mm -mm -mm. Can I turn this around? No, I cannot. Ah, no, I cannot. What if I move it this way? And then I move that. Oh, that's not worked there at all, has it? No. Well, it's not worked there in the slightest. Um, no, it's taken up more space, in fact. Do a two, a two, oops, a two, and, oops, no, don't combine. Two and a one. And then we move Oh, this is not helpful. Curses. Right, if that then moves, there's no way that's going to help there. Mm -mm -mm. I love and hate this game. I'd even love to say that there's like a flashy outro when you complete the end. There's not, there's nothing. It just ends. Um, so move that, and then that, and then that, I guess. That's not really going to help. I have the right amount of spaces, they're just not all together. Um, which is unfortunate. Uh, move that there, move that there. Move that there. That won't move that way. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Okay. Oh dear, I don't like that at all. Let's have a think about this. Let's think. I just need to message. I just need to send a quick message to my wife saying I'm going to be a couple of minutes. I'll cut this out of the thingy. 
out of the YouTube. Probably. I'll probably cut this out of the YouTube. Let's be honest. I'd love to say I will. If I remember, I definitely will. Oh, right. Pop that there. So I can see it. Okay. <laughs> I had to double check then. <laughs> Questionable results. Doomsday Prepper Tetris. Yep. We are very close. Um, I refuse to give up until we've done it. Okay. Let's think about this differently. You're an awkward piece. You can just go there. Right. I need you out of the way. And there's no way I can now put that in there. So, yeah, I was going to say something really sarcastic then to question what results like. That's not true. My wife doesn't wear a watch, but she does. She wears a Fitbit all the time. Um, uh, I'll just do like a jigsaw. I'm overthinking this. Oh, it's rained while I've been streaming. I hope the floor's not wet. That's unfortunate. Um, right. So what about you? Let's pop you there, and let's pop a thingy there. But then the SMG... Oh, no, the SMG's down. I see. So now... There. And there. Wait, no, that's not enough. One, two, three, four, five, six, one. <gasps> no, it is! Wait, is that the right way around? Yes! Yes! We've done it. That's all, stranger. <laughs> Thanks for playing. That's it. That's the end of the game. <laughs> That's all we got. <laughs> oh, man. Well, that was a bit of a journey, wasn't it? Uh, it's not raining here. The air is just wet. Yeah. Yeah, it's been like that today. Oh, my God. My brain is fried. <laughs> I once again... I still don't have a sound effect for my character, for the character success, like the Final Fantasy da -da 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 noise or anything like that. No fanfare. All I've got is character death noises. So I can't even, I can't even celebrate properly. I need to put that on the list of things to do. Oh, that was fun. I enjoyed that. Right, I'm going to do a quick, um, to do add fanfare. Um, is, is this how this relationship's going to go? Question of results. Um, I'm going to do a quick outro for YouTube and then we're going to wrap things up for the night because I'm pretty sure food is ready downstairs. <laughs> well, that was save room. And while we hit a couple of blocks here and there, I can honestly say it's one of my favorite little puzzle games. It's actually probably at the minute my favorite puzzle game just because I kind of love inventory management. I don't know what it is about inventory management. I just love the idea of it in games, in action adventure games, Resident Evil games. Whenever there's a bit of inventory management, even things like, you know, Stardew Valley and Animal Crossing and stuff like that and Cozy Grove, love me a bit of inventory management. Maybe that's just me. I don't know. Hopefully there are other people out there. Maybe if you're watching this video, you also love inventory management. Maybe pop a comment in the uh, comments below. Just let me know. Let me know I'm not alone in this. Let me know I'm not insane. Um, or more insane, I should say. Anyway, if you like this video, please give it a like. If you dislike it, there's a dislike button. And if you want to help the channel grow for free, then please consider subscribing. It really helps quite a lot. But for now, I'm going to sign off from Lo-Fi Gaming. I'm going to wish you all the absolute best that you can be. Stay safe, stay wonderful, and I'll see you next time. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's us. Um, what am I? What am I doing next? When is? When is? When is? When is? When is? When is? Let's open Discord a sec. Let's close this because I I will be on it. Start and credits. No, just close. How do escape? Escape. There's no exit button. 
Um, I will be the first to admit that I have forgotten when I'm streaming next. And it's not on... Let's not open Discord on this. Let me just go break real quick. Uh, let me open Discord a second on here. Because the July schedule is now live. Um, and... Oh, streaming mode is active. That's fine. That's cool. Uh, game? Gam? Yeah. Discord. Uh, schedule. Cool. There we are. So the next one... Oh, God, that's a tiny picture, isn't it? Let's just save that real quick. Oh, no, can I just open this? Open link. There we go. And then zoom. Uh, the next one's going to be Monday, 6 or 9, which is going to be screaming at a joypad. We're going to be continuing and hopefully finishing Spooky's uh, Jump Scare Mansion. Um, and then maybe exploring some of the different uh, bits and pieces in regards to Spookies. I'm not 100% sure yet. We may do Spookies and then do something else. I've got a couple of bits and pieces lined up for screaming at a joypad. Tuesday is going to be just chatting from 6.30 till 7.30. Basically, what I'm going to do is either... If I don't do it beforehand, which I might, I've got some new kit that I'm going to set up, including a new monitor. I've got new cables, new risers, loads of stuff. Um, basically, just give the desk a bit of an overhaul. What I might do is I might just have the, the camera and mic set up and I might just do that for an hour or so. Or I'm going to do some video editing and I'll just have you guys on stream as well. So you, you can see it, use it as a bit of an ask me anything session. So uh, and just keep me company. And that's going to be it for next week. I've got some family coming down next week, uh, which I'm really excited about. And then the following week is a pretty bumper week. So I think we've got uh, D&D &D that week as well, which I need to just pop in here. But if you want to see this schedule, you can join the Discord. Um, and also, hopefully by the end of the weekend, I will have all of this on the Twitch scheduler as well. But for now, I'm going to uh, bid you all a very fond farewell. Thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, stay safe, stay wonderful, and I'll see you next time. Thanks very much, everyone. Bye-bye.